Are we good to go? I think we are good to go. Alright, hey there everyone. Uh, so we're going to be starting Frosthaven, a Let's Play series. I'm pretty excited about it. Uh, uh, at the very least, um, we're going to be bringing back some of the people from uh, who did the Let's Play Gloomhaven series with us. So if uh, you remember that's Mats Kotzman, Ven Draken, and the Masochism Tango, of which they're at least at least Tango, but they're, they're generally active on my Discord, and we're going to be rolling through uh, a fun... The first scenario, and we're actually going to ideally be doing a whole campaign here, so... Um, I'm going to be playing the Banner Spear. We're going to have also, a Bone Shaper, a Drifter, and a Death Walker alongside me. So, uh, I think that's going to be where we're starting. And I'm going to make sure that everything's set up correctly, because I'm a little, just a little paranoid. I think we're good to go. All right. So, I'm going to unmute them so they can actually start talking. Hi there. So, we have Vince Draken and Matt Scotsman here with us. Say hi. Hello. Uh, that's also an Hello acceptable. there. Hello there. All right. Do you, have a, do you have a voice for this? No. Oh, okay. All right. I was just I was thinking you might have a voice for this. Eh, no. I'll do my voice for narration if I need to. Okay, got it. I do think we will have to do some narration. Since I, I'm, I mean, I've got to read all these people's names. Yes. So. Oh, that's true. So we're going to be doing that. If, uh, so should we be waiting on Tango? I feel like we should, because that would be... He's yeah. a nice guy. We need, we need, he needs to know how it starts. Otherwise, that would be, like, really mean. Yep. So, um, I guess running through... Um, going through some strategy because uh, we actually did this in the other stream ultimately uh, I'm actually going to be cycling in two of the X cards uh, this is not an all right to answer that this is not an unofficial mod this is a just a separate mod um, Gloomhaven enhanced kind of does the uh, mod for the the skeleton of the mod for playtesting but this is not Frosthaven advanced they're still in the process of making that but I am very impatient so um, this is Frosthaven Assisted, I think, uh, which is actually pretty good. It's got some really good functionality on it, so I'm pretty enthused. So, but um, personally, uh, especially for my quest, uh, which my quest is to get 150 experience from ability cards, I think one of the easiest things is to bring both banners to make sure that every time I do a scenario, I get four experience by dropping them. Also, at all costs makes uh, some of my things easier to... Uh, summon plus every time I create or some of the formations easier to do plus every time I create a reinforcement I get an experience so this is going to be an easy five experience right here every scenario plus every formation I run is going to be another experience so we'll see in the end how much I uh, adds up um, although I do generally like deflecting maneuver I think we're not going to have as much elemental variety and honestly I might even pitch javelin uh, for that, although Javelin's pull is a little bit too useful and range attack's good. The pincer movement, I don't think we're going to be getting on the other sides of people, and I'm just not a fan of incendiary throws, so I did swap in Resolved Courage, which I personally think is better than, like, all the X's and also, or all, most of the level 1 cards, and although I usually don't bring regroup, I feel like with towing banners and uh, Mad Scotsman summoning skeletons, I felt that that was a good pick as well as the X card driving inspiration, which I already stated the two experience plus the, uh, I have a feeling that with the amount of things we're going to have in this group, everyone performing, he performing heal oneself to start their turn. Sounds like a really good, just potential. No, I'm not going to drop it immediately, but that sounds like something that'll pay off. So those are, yeah, that'll be very nice. Be very happy to have that around. Yeah. I figured, especially with you, constantly hurting yourself so i'm not going to be dropping that immediately but I'll, I'll be able to pick you up with regroup later um we'll figure out which ones when i want to drop banners because uh looking at the first scenario and seeing that first off we do get two giant giant 
uh, things there and one like kind of narrow thing here. I'm worried that dropping them immediately and then trying to tell them to move because they don't move on their own might become more of a chore and not worth the effort. So I'm going to probably wait to drop them. So, uh, Cliff, do you have any words on the cards you picked? You don't have to, but I'm curious. Um, well, the only change that I made really was to uh, swap out malicious conversion for uh, X card here. Wrath of the Turned Earth. Yeah. Wrath of the Turned Earth, because I like that uh, summon granting attack. Other than that, it's my first time playing the Bone Shaper, so I'm going to have fun stabbing myself and summoning skeletons. Oh, stabbing yourself is fun. All right, uh, Tango. It, it sounds it's like... not. Oh, it's, it's not? It's, it's a definite downside. Aww. Wait, what's the downside? Stabbing myself to summon skeletons. The skeleton part is nice, but the stabbing myself is not. Agree to disagree, friend. <laughs> We, uh, uh, we here at Rage Patrick Gaming do not advocate for self-harm. Yeah. Continue, yeah. But continue Every, with the joke. For legal reasons, everything said here is a joke. Do not actually do terrible things to yourself. Your family loves you. Um, <laughs> <laughs> okay. So we're going to move these on there. Just your, so fr your friends will miss you. Um, uh, all right. Uh, do you have any questions before we like get rolling? I did get everyone's. Uh, Tanko, this is your quest. Uh, we can't. So do we get to pick from three? Um, are yes, we connecting? Yes. To your, are we connecting to your oh. thing? Because it's not showing up on the the server, Majig, and I have even have friends on. Oh, um, we should. Maybe we aren't friends anymore. Did you unfriend me for some reason? Um, All right. In, in the I can't think in the, of a reason in, I would have. In the moderation chat, I just put the password name because I know you're a moderator, so. Oh, am I? Yeah, you are. Okay. In, in the Discord. Uh, oh, let's try. Let's try wait, doing it. Maybe. Wait, just... he's a moderator. You never know that. I I feel so so betrayed. <laughs> how how long have you not known that? I've been a mod for like. Alice, I've known you for like twenty years. Like like. What is this crap? Like uh. Well, I I've imagine been Tom, for like a year or I something imagine like Tom that. Lehrer over here actually inter interacts with the crazy people on this Discord. So. Yeah. That's fair. I have the excuse of Night Shift and children to uh, make me disappear. Yeah, like, I, I have, I, it's not all fun and games. Like, I have to clean up a lot of problems, most of which I cause. I'm just the janitor that greets people <laughs> and tells them to get, to get out. That's fair. <laughs> a little bit of a got a little bit of janitorial business but you know what, what helps with cleaning things up is poisoning pigeons in the park why are we po poisoning pigeons in the park that's a <laughs> he's, just been quoting, he's just he's, he's just quoting tom lair songs all over there because uh of my because of my the masochism tango because of my mom oh. my moniker oh uh-huh uh, listen, you'll pay, a... you'll, listen, when you pick up when you pick up pick it up and you start doing the same thing we will all go together when we go yeah. Thank God. Okay. All right. <laughs> so before we before we like actually get rolling, um, I don't know how to work it in, but uh, something something the Vatican rag something something. Yep. All right. So. Genuflect, I'm, genuflect, genuflect. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna go through the uh, there's just the characters for the stream real quick. Uh, uh, and maybe that'll help uh, people. So we have Rebecca de Corbin, which is. A little bit of a stretch for the joke, but uh, she is a human banner spear. Pronouns are she, her. And her quest is life lessons. She has to get 150 experience from playing ability cards. So uh, if it said just get 150 experience, that would be an incredibly easy quest. 150 from cards, uh, notably longer. I don't think it's necessarily hard because eventually you're going to play experience on cards to level up. But the, the speed and be able to, like, get it in a normal, like, time. Like, this 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 depends entirely on how you play to get experience. So, and then she'll be unlocking Envelope 90, which, uh, for spoiler reasons, we're going to assume everything's sealed, even though I'm aware of a lot of what these unlock. We're not going to reveal those on stream until until we actually unlock them. We have Saul Goodman, the Deathwalker, and I don't know what Saul's pronouns are, but Saul has uh, Greed is Good, who needs to have 80 gold plus 20 gold times uh, our prosperity. Our prosperity is one now, so all you need to do is get 100 gold. Why does Saul Goodman want 100 gold? What are, what are you doing? I have debts I need to pay. Oh, is that it? The mafia is on his ass. The cartel. 
I have a lot of people on my ass. Take your pick. I feel like I better call you. Yeah, you should. You should definitely. We have. Get my we don't talk much. We have Doctor Britt Bones DMT. She's a dentist. She's. I love it. Ah, uh, cause she's a dentist. I don't know why. Okay. She's working on team building, literally, because she is creating a team with bones. Yep. But uh, her quest involves reading eight different, uh, re reading a person's name during eight different outpost phases in events or sections. So ultimately, we're going to have to just come go through outpost phases and do things. That are all your... Go ahead. I'm sorry. I didn't no, no, no. That's it, This one's just basically a time-gated one. Go ahead, though. I'm just curious, are all of your skeletons going to be named Nurse? I don't know. And, reception, and Receptionist? Yeah. You know? That's I mean, I mean, one would, I suppose I'll probably have to wait to train one as a dental hygienist until they're... Yeah. Maybe, like, the Wraith is a de dental hygienist. Oh, that yeah. probably makes the most sense. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> and last but not least, we have Clyde McFlatner, the Inox Drifter. Uh, Clyde wants to um, assist the Esthers in constructing their outpost here in the frozen north. Uh, this is significant not because of Clyde and his bond with Esthers. This is significant because of um, the masochism tango and his um, utter love and appreciation for Marcel Sertechka's scenario design. And I believe that basically drove most of your he is, times. after all, a masochist. I mean, I, I listen. The, the 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 pain and punishment life doesn't choose. Uh, I didn't choose the pain and punishment life. It chose me. Because again, these were random draws. So yeah. Uh, no, you that, you had you had two to pick from. And right, then, and you're like, this is the funny one, and I'm like, I okay. Did, I did say that is the fu that is fair. I did. And, and you're like, and I'm like, is it terrible and horrible? And you're like, yes. And I'm like, well, it's got. It some, is the it, funny one. It's it's got. It does. Um, it has some hard scenarios in it. Yeah, don't worry. Since I'm a dentist, I can uh, sew up the gash they make with their lash. Only if it's in my gums. You're not, you know, licensed for like arms. Yeah, I suppose that's true. Not licensed for like arms. All right. Yeah. Unless my arms get teeth, in which case uh, we have bigger problems. Well, I don't, I don't know with Marcel's scenario. Design, yeah, it might happen. Wrong. That's true. Jigsaw does love his weird. Oh God, are we calling him Jigsaw? That's okay. That does scenario. Yes. Right. Yes. Okay, this just in. Uh, Marcel like is game? now Jigsaw. Would you like to play a game? All right. By the way, before we start, start, although we did get like quests and other stuff, you do have three battle goals, which should be in the bottom left corner of your screen. Go ahead, pick one. It doesn't really matter how you do it. I just put mine back in. You don't need to. You can set them aside. Up. If you want to say, hey, that sounds like work, set them aside and we'll do it. I currently have my one battle goal picked here. I want to make sure it is okay. So, uh, it's, it's been a minute because some of us don't love this game as hardcore as you do. Excuse me, did you just say... Um, so anyways, no, 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 what I was going to say is, like, we don't show each other these things, right? Those, these, this is the battle goals right here. Oh, okay, these are something different. That, th these are the X cards. You actually probably want to use one of those X cards, because I think you just okay. wanted to beat things with a club. One of those cards is really good at beating things with a club. I mean... But you can look at I'm them. Down, I'm, down for, I'm down for murder, and however is most convenient and easy. Yeah. Okay, but I need to draw from these. Yes, those three, and pick one. And where do I put these again that I can see them and you can't? Uh, draw them to your hand, I think. Yeah, uh, yeah. I don't think they have the sort by initiative thing they, in this. They, they don't. So just set it on the ground. Put your hand. Set it okay. on the ground and press the key four. Four. Ah, ha. Thank you. Okay. Also, there's like a max hand size in this where this gets confused, so some of them might get flipped over. So. I think right, as long okay. as you don't have like 14 or 15 cards. I think it's 15 cards where it gets annoyed. Not 100% sure, but okay. no, no one has a hand size of 15. So. And for notation, remind me, um, there's the, check marks the, that have different amount of check marks. Yes, what do that means? That mean? Okay, to reminder, every three check marks gives you a perk. Perks are good shit that you can use to improve your character. Okay, so that's so, how many you earn. Yes, the two check marks are considered to be more difficult. But you get more shit from doing them. Okay, so this is the one I'm going to select. Where do I throw it? Uh, put here. it, put it there. 
and I'll All right. deal with these two. All right, well, bye. Um, and what's my hand size again? Twelve for, for the drifter. Yeah. It should be under your dude's picture. Uh, twelve. One, two, three. Oh yeah, that's a good point. Six, eight, nine, so we have two twelves. Okay, so these are them. This is my <laughs> hand here. Two twelves and eleven and an eight, or and two twelves can... and eleven and a ten. And and I should do... just replace one of these with one of these. That's what you're saying. Uh huh. Yeah, um, the, the card I think you'll like is called Fortitude, but uh, Destructive Fury also sounds like you. Yeah, so. it's pretty big blasties. Of yeah, area. it's a loss, and it burns through a billion charges, but like, it does sound like, hey, I'm going to blow up a room. You can always get rid of some of your base cards. Like, there's a... Well, that's what I have to get rid of one, so... One to... or two. But I, I, both of these are basically... Two? Yeah, both of these uh... are, I think, yeah. I could take two of them. I yeah, see. you can take all three if you want. No remorse is a good, um, good initiative with heal. a decent heal, and there's a loss if you want to be able to move and attack real fast. But some people don't like that. Uh, for playing any, it's other mostly ones. used for its good heal. So this is one of those poor, the perpetual ones, right? Uh, no, this one's the perpetual the ones. Thing. All right, I'm gonna temporarily steal your cards. Stop. All right, the perpetual ones are the six on the left. No, so right, Mark, you were right. If you oh, play the bottom a of four to two, on there. yeah, oh, it's a oh, loss oh. less for the entire scenario. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Dingus bat. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm dingus about. bat. Yes, you know. All right, I thought you're. I was like, yes. The first off, that one's actually both sides of it are really good because one of them is a perpetual, but it's not a perpetual that you have to deal with charges. Like that. Yeah, they're both 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 halves are really good. Either any hit other stuff really hard, hit. or get charges back every time you kill shit. Both sound like you. In there. God damn, there are a lot of things that have charges. Yeah, um, so you don't have to bring all of them. Like, yeah. Um, but some of them, the other half's really good. Like, um, but like Unbreakable and Relentless are ones where they only give you charges. But if you like Retaliator Shield, I'm gonna try to take some hits if you don't want to bring the Shield one. So, and Cliff's skeletons are going to be up there, probably taking hits too. So, um, and even then, the, the other ones tend to weigh out that one, in my opinion. So, but anything else, like whatever combo you want to do for damage or other stuff, there's like movement, retaliate, healing, and then melee and range damage. But even if you don't like the melee or range ones, the other side of the melee and range cards are also pretty solid. So, so he did any, many, many by. Precision aim, cool. <laughs> okay. Uh, and if we have our cards picked, I think ultimately we can leave uh, Matt Scotsman to start the, the the prologue if you want to. All right. The prologue. Here we go. Welcome to Frosthaven. With your head down, you march one foot, then the other. You try to block out the pain, the throbbing in your toes, the numbness in your face. Just keep the rhythm, you think. One, two. But the wind isn't so easily ignored. It claws at you, whipping up ice and snow like tiny hooks, making every breath difficult. Your skin is thick. You always prided yourself on that. But nothing is thick enough for this. You are walking through the frozen wastes, a place far to the north, where only the hard and the lost dare to travel. Of course, that's probably why they hired you. It's been ten days of plowing through snowdrifts as high as your waist, and there's still no sign of the town. You are mercenaries, hired as part of a support team, the first group of the season, sent to check on humankind's most distant outpost, Frosthaven. It's a place forgotten by most of the world, a tiny settlement carved out of the frozen wilderness that, for half the year, is wholly cut off from the Empire, isolated by towering, unbreachable drifts. But as of last week, just enough snow has melted off the Imperial Pass for a team to get through. They were hiring, and your coin purses were empty. So then, here you are. 
No one really knows what awaits you in Frosthaven. Your snow-muddled mind struggles to imagine what sort of people could survive through the winter in a place like this. But whoever's there, you hope at the very least they've left a fire going. All right. And then that's the prologue and then the introduction to the scenario. Oh no. All right. Oh no, 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 no. The introduction to the scenario. We're skipping scenario zero because we don't need it. All right. Scenario goals. The scenario is complete. When all enemies in it are dead at the end of that round, read 9.1. The sounds greet you first, muffled metallic pangs, a voice howling. It's difficult to make anything out with the wind rushing past your ears, but you'd know that tune anywhere. There's a fight up ahead. But a fight means people, and if there are people, then the town must be close. You hear more, a scream, the clash, crash of steel against stone, a deep, earthy growl. You're running now. Your legs are wasted from the hike. Your shoulders ache from your gear. But the sounds are close now, and up ahead you see a gauzy orange light blooming in the air. With one last push, you round the final bend in the trail, and you see it, Frosthaven, engulfed in flame. Great petals of fire burst from windows and crawl over roofs. People stream from the town's ruined gate, their faces bent in panic. A moment later, you see the object of their terror, a massive creature with two legs and two hulking arms covered entirely in thick white fur, three gnarled horns crowning its head. Algox Raiders, we're doomed, cries an elderly porter beside you. They're stronger than anything else alive. We've come all this way for nothing. As if to prove the point, the Algox you've been watching catches a fleeing outposter with one hand and hurls him backward as if he weighed nothing. Ten days you've been hiking. Ten days and this is what you find. You breathe out a thick plume of foggy air and hoist your weapon high. Time to get to work. Special rules. All city guards are allies to you and enemies to all of their monster types. City guards do not perform turns, but instead gain an additional innate shield 1 for a total of shield 2 at level 1, and retaliate 2, and have an initiative of 50 for the purpose of focusing. Alright. So, the short version there is, we should protect the guards. Alrighty, so, if we have our goals picked, do you guys remember? Uh, pick two cards, one's your initiative. Your initiative card's always on the left side. I see Cliff's already gone ahead. Uh... Na, 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 na. Cats. So I guess Question. my yeah, fire away, what, sir. What have these people ever done done for us? Uh, we so are, we, we are paid us money. Yeah, we're. Oh, okay, money. that's good enough for me. Yep. All right. Um, I'm take it, Tango. You're doing a setup turn. Uh, there's a lot of shit to look at and read to set up. So probably. Also, okay. I don't know what I'm doing, so I'm just gonna. The littlest bit of advice is usually pick, pick one of these cards that have those like trackers on top and one bottom. Pick one of each, and those are like what you're good at. That's your like. Yeah, I have turn. like five of them. It's scary. Yeah. Yeah. Um, well, pick one up, one top, one bottom. It doesn't matter. Whatever ones you like, pick one top, one bottom, and you should be good. How do I look at this again? There used to be like a. If you hold if you hold Alt down, it'll Alt. That was what it was. Yeah. Ah. And then Alt Shift if it's upside down. Okay, so. Boy, it's been a minute since I've messed with this. Okay. Yeah. Uh, um... That goes back, and then Alt or Shift. This is a okay. stupid question. Are the Algox not our friends? No, they are. They are not our friends. Good. Oh, this elderly porter is very upset about them being there. Okay. All right. So, um, I'm thinking about move, moving Tango forward. I'm not going to drop a banner in this first room, so I think I'm going to avoid doing that stuff. Um, how about this? I move Tango forward a little bit, not super early, and I'm going to disarm the uh, disarm the guard here. And I should move myself closer so I can start dealing with those archers. 
I feel like I should be the one chucking stuff at them. I don't want to go too early so the archers move towards us. No, That's my I'm plan. I'm going violet. I'm going uh, to yes. make myself a friend. Um, I'm going blue almost indigo. Holy god, I have to get the color chart up again. <laughs> you don't. You just don't know what the rainbow is? That's. I don't remember what's you long and an short. Ally? My Boy, G, Roy G. Biv, man. Oh, in that case... Fudge. Well, okay. I'll go with uh, orange. All right, you're going. You're going orange. Got it. Okay, so hang on. Wait. Um, you said you were going to be moving me, kind of. Yeah. Not so early. -ish. Question, question: Are you are you playing are you playing two setup cards or only one? Because if you're not move if you're moving, I don't have to use this other card. Uh. But, I guess I do have multiple setups. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, if you only her. want to set up one, that's fine. But you have usually they have the capacity to run two, potentially three later in the scenario. Uh, let's just um. Hmm. And uh. All right, Alice, you're definitely gonna have to tell me what some of these symbols mean. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna. What, what's the weird symbol that has a token with the arrow pointing up? I'm actually just. Gonna oh my god, out. my card. Yeah, I'm just gonna bring these out. So your main thing is this: this weird symbol is a shadow. You have shadow yeah. tokens. That's how your whole class operates. This card is basically your main card. It, it really is. The, oh, the, like I should just drop that right now. Yes. That the top part, the the basic thing of that is, whenever you attack an enemy, you mark it. Every time that enemy dies, uh, they drop a shadow. So all you have to do for the rest of the scenario is attack enemies, and then eventually when they die, you get shadows. That stays forever in the scenario. Okay, yes. yeah, I probably need to change yeah. plans. Then. That's perfectly fine. I was going to say, I know we're all pretty... Uh, haven't played in a while and haven't even looked at these classes, so... Yeah, so are yeah. you talking about the... Um, which which symbol were you talking about, Pete? Which, yeah, let's, which symbol? Let's start. Because you got the, this one on so, bottom of Sunless Apparition, which is that. that's loot. That's loot. Yeah, loot one, and then loot also one. teleport to a hex. Yeah, teleport. Okay. Yep. All right, now I'm getting it. Cool. If you have any other questions, not at this time. That's fine. Yeah, I'm still not a fan of the the card redesigns. Oh, gotta say, uh, looks like we're is... playing a friggin' sci-fi game. <laughs> The funny part I'm, is... Here I, I am. I, I'm Terminator, as you can tell by all the skulls. I'm playing Terminator. I actually really like it, so maybe I'm weird. Well, no, it's just an opinion. No, uh, my opinion's correct. Sorry, I was supposed to say, well, that's like your opinion, man. Oh, yeah, you're supposed to. Duh. Yeah. But yeah, we've all got, to get, all, like, we've all got to get used to this new math new math oh god uh what uh, tokens are you talking about uh these things here yeah you're gonna use those once you get the cards out oh okay so i should just pull some out yeah sure if you want to i mean uh yes being weird is dr. good dr. Dr. Brittle Bones did. dr brittlebins did dr dr brittlebins yes um so yeah once you pick another card, we can roll. You're going to be playing the top of that, so just pick like a you bottom. Know, but, what? Uh, Scotsman, if you were going with a uh, bone shaper dentist as your plan, why didn't you go with Dr. Teeth in the Electric Mayhem? Because uh, it's a reference to a professional wrestler. Do uh, Dr. Britt uh, ba Dr. Britt Baker, DMD. Uh, she's a dentist. Uh, okay, okay, she, okay. She's an actual dentist. Okay. All right. Guess what? Jesus Christ! There's a dentist. That's a, a pro wrestler. I mean, yep. First off, that's amazing. So uh, if, wow. So just a heads up: if you uh, realize that the other mod was really cool because it had an initiative tracker, this one has an external one you can connect to. But I think I'm sharing it in Discord. So first off, uh, Matt Scottsman, can you at least see that, and then other people? Because I know he confirmed you could see yep. it earlier. Yep. I right. can see it. All right. So the first thing so, we're going to do is. Where should we be looking? It, you just if you want to see the initiative order. But she's, uh, yeah, she's got it in her. Um, she's streaming it to, to this. Oh, okay, that's what that stream is. Gotcha. Right. So first, 
that thing is going to do a big disarm. Here's the cool part. It's going to be disarming this guy who doesn't attack, but it does have pierce. But it is a weak effect, so um, the guard loses uh, one health. Bring it down to four. No. I know, that's our friend. And it, it's got pierce too. That's the annoying part. But we need to take this guy out because his piercing attacks are going to like blow through our friend. If it wasn't, by the way, slight, tiny, tiny spoiler. The more guards we save, the better our reward. But that's that. Next, we have uh, this guard. This guard isn't even going to move or do anything. He's going to shield up and then retaliate. So anyone who hits him this turn is going to suffer damage. Clyde McFlatner, it's now your turn. Hmm. Which your cards are as such fortitude oh. and sustained momentum. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, which, uh, it's your turn. Go ahead. So, hmm, maybe I did this wrong. But whatever. We're learning. Um, sure. I don't get to move on this one and do that setup. I have to do the setup or move, right? Correct. Yep. Okay. Same with, I guess I'm, mm, that's right. I, I thought this was on top. I, I goofed. Uh, well, um, it does, oh, the, the, that. So you wanted to play both of those. You'd have to do that. Over yeah, turns, yeah. 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 Uh huh. Um, let's see here. So I would lose this card either way, right? No, what this is this, one, this, 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 this is, this is a non loss. It's got a, oh, it's only on this bottom section. Yeah. That's a loss. So you could okay. always play that later if you wanted to play that. Right. If you wanted to do the attack now and then put that and in. And then the I could later. just use this as a standard move and not lose it? Yeah, correct. Absolutely. Okay, and it would not be lost. Correct. It would only right. be lost if I did the power. You yep. got it. All right, that's right. Okay. That's actually uh, particularly fortunate since that guy just shielded up and Fortitude has Pierce on it. Yeah, so if you actually did that, you'll. Yeah, you'll is that the. Um, is that what the little triangle or the the diamond is uh the, yeah the the yellow diamond yep that's pierce okay oh i need to remember kind of thing here yeah. okay so, yeah. well, neat. so do go. you want to do a default move too yeah let's just fuck this dude up um is it possible you want to go on the other side for me you want to just fuck this dude up from the right uh yeah uh, and where's the card thingy that right. i drew right here um yeah i think you you might have an icon in the bottom right I do now. Okay, hit the draw button there. Bang! Oh, oh shit, wow. Motherfucker. Did, was that a six? Krug smash you, lore. Six damage. Well, good start to the yeah. campaign, everyone. This campaign's going to be easy because Tango is only going to be drawing crits. That guy's down to one health. I don't think I'm going to be disarming him. Just a heads up. <laughs> Clyde, Clyde, break brain. All right, Saul, it's your turn. Very good start, though. Clyde, Clyde hit, make meat, meat confetti. Uh, yes, yes, Clyde hit, make beat confetti. All right, all right, go ahead. And then Saul. these go to discard. Is this the discard pile here now, or is that experience? Um, I think you can hit a button right here. The oh, wait, no, those don't do. How do you just go to discard? On one hand, Saul could, I think you grab them, uh, put them, them to the left. There. Yeah, put them left there. On one hand, Saul could wreck somebody. On another hand, Saul needs to set his stuff up. Correct. Fine. It's funny, they have a a sustain button and a loss, but not loss a discard. Button, not a discard button. Actually, I think they auto go to the discard in this mod. Like if you leave oh, them there. Oh, just after the turn. Okay. Yeah. So I'm gonna oh, test it out just there. if you leave them there. I'll just test that. Yeah. All right. Cool. Go ahead. Uh, so you're putting Saul. Saul will move up and activate his stuff. Cool. And it looks like you're also. Infusing dark in the process, so we have dark here. All right. Yes. Is that your turn? Yes. All right. So make sure that one thing is in your hit the persist button here, and I think that'll put it to your zone. We'll see. We're getting used to this mod. Did it not work? Oh, I, at the end of the turn, it'll do it. Cool. All right. Whatever. Um, these things are going to do power shots at range five. One, two, three. Th one, two, three, four, five. They are one, two, three, four, five. Hey, hey what's up, guys? Hey, uh, if you wanted to, by the way, since we would have seen that, did you not want to move all the way up? No, nope, fuck it. Are you, are you sure? 
because how much damage is it? Um, it's gonna, or do you need me not to be there? No, it, it would have been. It's going to do on average ten damage or zero damage if you're here. I mean, one of them will still hit him. Mm, one, two, not two. No, do line of sight reasons. No, but the other guy still will. Oh, this guy. Oh, yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Yes. So it's going to do five let's... damage. Yeah, so you can at least Well, I, it doesn't seem like I have much choice in whether I get to live or not, since you're all just going to make me live. So, ugh, fine. I'll take the take the W, I guess. All where right. do we see the, where, where Actually, because it used to be over on this side. Now it's... Where are those cards? Looks like it's above where you play your cards. Where's the above where you play your cards? Sorry, I don't know what he's asking. I mean, oh, like, what they what they drew. Like, where are their cards? Oh, it's, it's, in, it's, the, in, the, it's in the Discord. Oh. Oh. I know, that's, oh, so that's, we, that's okay, the slight, okay. The slight this is gonna take this a, mod, yeah. It's going to take this some... It's going to take some use, getting used to. Okay. All right. Uh, five damage to the Drifter. Good thing you... We've forgotten most things. That's... That's fair. All right. So Clyde McFlattner is down to five. Wow. Very, very unfortunate. Uh, Rebecca de Corbin. Uh, oh, why is there an ad playing? I should tell that to not do that. The, the stream is ah. actually inter being interrupted with ads. All right. Remind me next time not to set that up. Welcome to YouTube. Unless they do Welcome that automatically. I don't like the fact that the ads play. All right. I'll, I'll fix Welcome that. Welcome to losing time. subscribers. Uh, I, I mean, I don't think I'm losing subscribers doing that. All right. Um, <laughs> there's there's different reasons, uh, Alice. Loses if, if you subscribers. don't have the ad, ad wah, play, wah. how are you going to get sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends? Oh, yeah, yeah. Raid Shadow Legends. And or Raycon or NordVPN. All right, let me make sure this is drawing from my stack. It does. Uh, I have unfortunately gained an experience, and I don't disarm him, which is very, very sad. Yeah, so sad. Very sad. I just kill him instead. And now hey. he turns into a loot icon. Little thing. There we go. Uh, that's pretty de decent, though. So, um. Uh, that's all I'm doing for my turn. I move up. I gain an experience. Okay. Don't kill that. So I'm going to play the top of life and death to summon a skeleton friend and hurt myself. But since uh, Rebecca de Colbert helpfully murdered that skeleton, I'm going to use the bottom of Fell Remedy to heal myself the two that I took damage in summoning my skeleton friend. The doctor hurt himself today. All right. Uh, so you take two damage? Eh, I think I do still feel, but I take two damage and then I heal it. So. But where are you getting the bones? All right. So I think that's Whoa, it. Oh, okay. What happened? My uh, mouse does not seem to be in the right spot. All right. Because I'm hitting increment HP here, but for some reason it's cursing someone. Oh, that is weird. Oh, hey Sam. Yeah, That's I think really I think there's something. Yeah, there's something weird about that. Uh. Oh yeah, it's it's got me. That's what it is. Weird. All right. Well, duly noted. Also, I can't click my. It's like I'm couple inches to the right of where I'm clicking it I don't, I don't yeah care. all right we're gonna have to figure out what that is I'm gonna get out and get back in if somebody yeah, could just, heal just, me back uh, up to six just uh, turn it off you, and on again. oh yeah you are healing yourself back up to six because that cool just all turn right. it off and on again yeah turning it off and on again is the idea and Cliff also gained an experience in the process so yeah experience all right uh now we pick two more cards Yeah, we need to, um, yeah, I'm going to change the monetization settings if that's something I can't control, because I swear I've seen a bunch of other live stuff where it doesn't interrupt it, so that's very frustrating. Um, so we have these annoying dudes over here. Um, now, if they've got someone in front of them, do they get disadvantage or? Yeah, I think I'm gonna. Uh, honestly, I think what I'm gonna do is run up to their face and chuck a spear at the other one. Like, what if I, I run up here, chuck a spear at them? 
I think that's probably the play. I'm going to go before them. Um, and just do some damage. I'm going to be a little out of position, but I think we'll be fine. Uh, actually, I think there's a button. Yeah, yeah. If you hit one, it puts it there. If you hit two, put two, it puts it there. So I forgot about that. That's pretty easy. So I'm going very early, very red. Um, I'm wondering if I can actually modify the monetizations while we're streaming, because I want to turn ads off. But uh, we'll wait for uh, Matt Scotsman to get back in. It's not letting me in because of the password. Did you change the password? I did not change the password. Well, that's weird. Uh, this is a technically sound group of idiots. This is, yeah. uh, let's see. That checks out with my existence. So uh, did I create chatter with that last round? or? Yes, you did. It's um now waning. So where the hell is? Oh, thank God, there. Yeah. yeah, they're all up here. When they're halfway full, that means there's a thing. So um, I'm doing things. You are. Are you using any lowercase or whatever? Entirely lowercase. All right. Is it plural? There was ah, that would probably make sense. Mm. Yeah. We figured it out. We did it, Reddit. Yeah, I was missing that S. Oh God, we're on Reddit. No, we're not. We're not on Reddit. It's we did it. Reddit as a reference because Reddit's awful. Oh, next we'll be on Twitter. Uh, no. Oh God, no. I, I thought I, Twitter was dead. I deactivated my Twitter account for uh, reasons related to the fact that I think the guy's piece of sh yeah, you know. Um. What you don't think that only people who have kids should be able to vote? Yes. Uh -huh. Whoa, what? Didn't uh, hear that one. That's new for this week. Oh. Okay, oh. cool. All right, oh. I've changed the settings. Hopefully it affects it in the live. I turned off uh, video ads on it. Jeez. When I I'm created sure. it, uh, yeah, it had them by checked by default. They used, to, they used to make it to where all of them were unchecked and you had to check. And now when you create new videos on YouTube, looks like they, like, we're going to load all the ads possible on it if you don't go in and update it. That sucks. YouTube, this, I mean, that's probably not surprising. YouTube sucks. All right. I think we're back, though. Um, oh, and like, and you're, Alice you're, has you're, been you're, kicked off YouTube. Yeah, you're, you're trash talking the platform that we're currently on. Yes. Oh, oh no. no. Trash talking YouTube is very much the norm. Yes. Yeah. Oh, uh, you need YouTube. to slide yourself up over one left. Yeah, I don't know what that third one is for. The, if some classes have the ability to. Oh, to play a third card. Wait, yes. three cards? What? Yeah, it's it's. I mean, even the 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 blink um, blade actually has an ability that says the next three times you go fast, play three cards instead of two. Yeah, the old it's quartermaster could do it. Good, do it too. I imagine they're going to get rid of that. But that was the belt thing, wasn't it? Um. Oh, there. Yeah, yeah there, that, there, there, that, were, there that, were other things. There were other things. Yeah. But in Gloomhaven 2.0, it probably won't anymore because it's supposed uh, to be balanced now. It's it's honestly. Uh, it, it's it's balanced, but it's still honestly most of the classes just most. I had to say about half the classes are just stronger than they were, but three classes did get a pretty big hit. But even then, the old the new three spears um, hits pretty hard. But can you still curse hers? Um, it's not as strong. Lame. Oh. Unsubscribing. Um. Okay. Okay, you're where subscribing. Are we here? Not anymore. That's a long point. Okay. I don't. I, I think this actually happened that the ad thing that was interrupting people was literally Raid Shadow Legends, which that's, oh yeah, God. that's yeah. I know. As soon as I'm like, oh, that's the reason I turned it off. Like, I don't are want. They, are they still having Ronda Rousey as a new character, uh, or is it a know. new ad after that one? <laughs> Just stop snarking and pick a card, God. I, I mean, what? she's still stuck on Mars, as far as I can tell. Oh, is she? Although she is also, she, is. She, she just lost the WWE uh, Women's Tag Team Champions. Oh, that's Saturday. very yeah. unfortunate. I don't yeah. keep up with wrestling. Well, so her, uh, I'm, I am still looking at my cards, so don't think that I'm wasting time here. But uh, her, her tag team partner, who has recently been cosplaying as uh, different chapters of Space Marines in her wrestling gear. Oh, that's cool. Uh, she dressed up as uh, Sons of Horus. And then betrayed her partner. 
Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so so. To nice. be fair, Ronda Ronda should knew uh, the lore and saw it coming. Yeah, that's WWE like... has gotten like turbo that's, nerdy, that's... man. People dress up like Vegeta and shit in it. Ronda uh, Rousey was dressed as Majin Vegeta. Oh gosh, I love this. Okay, maybe 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 I'll. No, I'm not gonna watch. I have other too much other stuff going on. Yeah. Don't, don't lie to us. You're. You can squeeze in some wrestling. Okay, I can squeeze in wrestling. Too far away from everything. Well, mm. move. You have some. Yeah, movements. that's probably a good thing to do. Move. Also, by the way, looting is mega important in this, uh, because we can't build up Frosthaven without it. So, if people want to, please do. I, I, I'm gonna yeah. get this one though. But I need money. Yeah. Then how go do we? Up and how do we it. make? How do we know? I, that, How do we do the little raid ping again? No comment. A uh, tab. Tab. No tab. comment, Alice. Oh, I know. You I'm need money. You need one. money. Okay, that Actions is I will do. Yes, we get it, Tango. Okay, the I'm going of Blue Indigo? Blue indigo. No, I, Indigo. Um, um, I'm making another friend, and oh, I'm going to move. I love friends. I'm going to hit something in the face. That sounds good. All right. So I'm going to hit the start button now. All right, there we go. And looking at, we have me at six. We have Clyde at 27. We have Saul at 28. Uh, the archers are going to be immobilizing people. Oh, that's fun. Uh, that's going to be me at um, 29. Really hard to read this, on the Discord. Um, I, I, I've, got it as, I've got it blown up as big as it will be. So it'll, it will just deal with it for now. It's not a big, huge, huge thing. But like. This, this guy's going to try to bless the monster deck, which is not optimal. I might just be like, hey, you know, fifth row down, what's that doing? Oh, how does the loot deck work? I don't even think I. Does did the, you make the loot deck? Did I make the loot deck? Or did the mod make the loot does, deck? Does it? Is there I a loot deck? a pen system. That's yeah. right. I used to just draw whenever stuff wasn't when I whenever, whenever I was Unix ignoring stuff. It's a system. I know this. <laughs> I know this. All right, uh, we're gonna look for the <laughs> loot deck. Actually, I'm gonna someone will look for it while I uh, just go ahead and try to attack this guy. Oh, someone else set the air for me. Thank you. Uh, we're gonna attack this guy over here. Uh, my thing didn't show up. Or is it a crit again? Are we getting lucky, guys? You can do, we shuffle? Oh, do the loot and oh yeah, we do the loot and frost. Duh, and there, did we shuffle? No. Well, you... Listen, uh, it's not important now. We're we're just okay. gonna continue playing for a while. Thank you, by the it's, way. It's not important. Oh, it's in the mod. In the, in the mod, yeah. All right, so now that it's my turn, I got. I'm getting four gold from this. So sadly, no materials, but that's still okay. Uh, next, it is now Mark's turn. Oops. Rip. Man, Alice. I know, I screwed it up. Punch the log. The log is just difficult terrain, so yeah, that's okay. I can, it takes I mean, more I'm to not move that, out, I'm not... right? Or is it more to no, move in? No, one, one extra to move in. Uh, yeah, I suppose wrestlers would call me a mark. I do. I can't, wait, that is that, that, that's the purple? Yeah. Uh, wait, there's freaking stuff on it. Ah, oh, crap. Well, that uh, changes things significantly. Uh, you could always just maybe do the move, heal yourself, and then do that. That's a ranged attack. Yeah, oh, that's what that little thing is. Okay. Oh, yeah. Good point. Yeah, the well, hexes um, do get bordered. But... Oh, wait. Hang on. Okay. That's what I intended to do was that and that. Well, uh, uh, yeah. We'll, we'll clean that up. Thanks for pointing that out, Sam. Okay. So yeah, so this is an move. attack to at range, too. So you could... Move up so there and shoot him from across the way. And then I heal two. Yeah, he does have a he does have a shield too. So you're probably ah, that's what. Uh, yeah, I I don't know what it is. Yeah, it might just be only Alice is allowed to do only things. Alice okay. is allowed to do things. So where did all those minus ones go? And we how do we correct that? Uh, I think one of them went to me. I have twenty, so I'm good. I've yeah, got 20. One of them went to me. Okay. We're going to figure out what's going on with that thing later. It's like uh, Vincent Kennedy McMahon has a couple extras in there. Yeah. Okay, we'll, we'll fix this. Too. Yeah, he uh, does. Okay. All right. Well. Hmm. Wait, what am I doing? 
Don't worry. I'm, I'm the mod has don't infiltrated worry. your attack modifier deck with a couple of extra plus ones that you don't sure need. Did. Minus ones right. that you don't need. Okay, whatever you're doing to myself. So get out of creative and let Triple H take over again. All right. Um, <laughs> so so uh, did you draw the attack modifier? I have not, but I'm going to shoot this. Yeah. Hit the draw oh, button on the bottom right. Don't tell me what to do, Mom. All right. He has a shield, too. You did an attack, too. No damage. Well, that was a waste. Yeah, it's it's really janky, but it is impressive. So, and uh, the, all the integration and stuff's pretty nice. All right, is that your turn? If so, I then can't. Saul. I, I moved, healed, and shot some dude in the face who didn't give two fucks. So. All right, you get uh, a hide. You get a what? A oh, hide. Neat. You hide. All right, and then um, what are you doing, Vince? Evidently, I'm assuming moving and black barraging. Yup, and burning the uh, shadow for it. Cool. All right, go right ahead. So technically, I can hit either the archer or the uh, priest. Um, the priest is probably the more annoying, but he does have shield too. So you probably need pierce. But at the other hand, the skeletons aren't going to hit it very hard. So. Uh, but I'm going to be immobilized, so we'll see. Okay, I'm going to go. It's up to you. This guy is shield too, but he's far more. You, you, he needs to be killed. But this thing is not as much of a threat, but you're going to do more damage to it. We'll let you pick. Mm. Uh, I'll uh, hit the priest. All right, hit the priest. All right, draw a crit now. Did you actually? It appears that he did, Did yes. we? All right, everyone shuffle your decks. The weird part is mine didn't... Mine started... I was like, mine started with a plus zero, then a crit. All right. I know this is possible, but it's uh, a kind of ridiculous. All right. We've all shuffled. I think we're good. Four damage, and you get an experience. Also, it's marked by your Deathwalker ability. So uh, when this guy dies, it, he'll create a shadow in the spot. Do I loot with that too or no, is that you, just not you, you don't loot because well there's nothing nothing you're standing on so you just defaulted move to i thought okay you did this and then move to yes, yes that is what i did yep so uh no no loot you weren't standing on anything uh next the uh, it's going to shoot foot me it can back up to here and it will do an attack two on me that'll be a one uh, so I take one damage and immobilize. Ow, my foot. Ow, my foot. Uh, guards go. Yes, uh, just play with a deck full of crits. I think that might be a little easy. Uh, Brett Bones, go ahead. Okay. These guys are going late. Don't like that. Oops, sorry. Okay. Uh probably want to move and then summon. Why is it wanting me to delete the highlighted yeah, object? What, what, I don't know what that I means. Just wanna, I, I just want to give myself an experience. I, I gave you the experience. Don't worry about the di the dice. Yeah, only, D only don't, Alex don't click anything because I think the mod thinks we're off, so I think we're pressing buttons and curses now. Yeah. I know. We'll, we'll uh, test. That's why I was like, I want to try to see if we can get so it earlier. Dark test. Tidings, bottom, done, damned, horde, top. New skeleton. Hurt me too, please. All right. I'll hurt you. You'll never amount to anything. I suppose I really should put these skeletons in order. Okay, I did. Good. Number one, and then number I two. I tried to hurt you, but I don't think it worked. Oh, and my skeleton goes... Eh, yes. before that. He does so. go, eh, before that. Then all these people are in his way, so... I should name these guys, I suppose. Uh, right. I'll think about it. That's my turn. That's your turn? Cool. And um, give me experience for summoning. Okay. Uh, the, the monster deck gets blessed. I think the best way to do that is just to do it and please stop that. In here. And... Uh, it heals all allies within range one, which is not itself. 
And there we go. All right, next round. I am not in range. I don't have a ranged attack. I do have other abilities, though. All right, so what are we going to do? Um, still can't do that. Can't do that. I could drop that. I have this ranged attack. Do we do that? I think we do that, yeah. Okay. That's gonna be good for experience too and good for tankiness. And I'm immobilized, so me like having to spend it forcefully spend a turn not moving isn't really a big hit if I do it that way, so. All right, uh, I'm gonna buff myself up so the rest of the scenario I'll be more durable. I'm gonna hit this archer. Cool. Um, Alternatively, Mr. if you want, uh, I can work Mr. on that. Mr. McMahon, are you planning on moving? Me? Yes, you're Mr. McMahon. Either I will move back to the archer or I'll move forward to the uh, priest. Cool. Uh, do you have an initiative yet? Nope. Okay, let me know when you do. I guess I probably could have used that. Actually, I definitely would have used that on my turn, when I think about it. And now I'm going to extra shuffle my deck. Probably actually one of the worst ones for me to pick. <laughs> Battle I'm gonna go violet, so don't worry about your initiative, Mr. McMahon. Sure. Violet, that's like really late. I'm Maybe, probably going uh, about yellow or orange. Say indigo violet. Indigo violet, still very late. All right, looks like we got stuff. I hit the start button. Uh, Rebecca de Corbin at 18, Clyde McFlatner at 23. Uh, the priest is going to be performing healing himself at initiative 23 after uh, Clyde goes. Saul at 34. Uh, the archer is going to double shoot at 56. And then at 83, uh, Dr. Britt Bones is going to go. So Hey, um, hey, hey. She's a dentist. Dr. Dentist, DMD, DMD, Brett Bones, DMD, yes. Um, first, I'm going to ask, hey, what are you doing over here? Who's you? Uh, oh, um, Tango. Probably moving here, and then bang, and then I guess also bang. No, no, that's not my friend. Um, just shooting this guy, I guess. Just shooting that guy with a muddle? Okay, cool. Well, it isn't going to muddle. Because he's a, uh, uh, and just well, he is gonna muddle, but he's not gonna heal. But that would have been a pretty good thing to screw with its attack. Gotcha. Um, so with I that in I, mind, I'm going to gain. I guess I could try and just swing and hit harder with relentless. Uh, yeah, if you wanted to. Uh, driving inspiration. I'm gonna create the light. Uh, and I'm gonna attack two. Sure, you're not me. gonna steal, steal away, away the, light. the light. Yeah, triosphere plus zero and plus two. I do two damage to the archer chunk chunk and then this goes active for the rest of the scenario i have shield one all right go ahead clyde yeah let's do that one two three, three. and then do just a default attack two with that yeah which no damage because of its shield and that minus one that sucks <coughs> boo the priest then heals himself for three. Uh, then Saul goes. Saul, bad guy? Whoa. Getting in his face. I'm rethinking this suddenly. Well, you can you can back up there and attack him with that attack, too. 
Did, oh, did you catch my, my Guilty Gear reference? Yes, there? I did, Mr. Bat Guy. Of uh, I'll get. Uh, he's only doing weak attacks. He's doing a target two, so he's going to get the shot off regardless. Have you um, looked at six at all? Uh, Street Fighter six? Are you asking me? Are you asking yeah. me? I'm asking Scotsman. Nope, oh, okay. not yet. I'm busy uh, playing Breath of the Wild again after <laughs> finishing um, Tears of the Kingdom. Playing Breath uh, of the Wild and knowing a crap about WWF. Yes, that too. Attack two. And uh, did you draw an attack? Yeah, is it that minus two minus right two? there? Oh, that sucks. That uh, that's balls. Yeah. That's that's balls. I don't know why you did that. You were supposed to not draw them. This is making up for the crits. All right. So um, next is that thing performs an attack on both of us. Um, minus. Oh, that sucks. Uh. So the minus one, it attacks me first. Minus one, minus one is zero, and then three damage to. Oof! Can I? Uh... Oh, leather armor. Yeah, you. I, yeah. I realize you had that. No, not three damage. Zero damage to the Death Walker. Oh yeah. All right. First, this bones moves up. I think the quickest path is there, and then I think that one, the quickest path is there. Yeah. All right, then go ahead. Indeed. Okay, how shall we do this? I will move. I don't have anywhere to move. That's <laughs> fine. Um, I should have moved. No, you're good. You moved where you where you needed to, so my dudes could walk forward. So that guy is the granted movement from the uh, bottom of Flow of the Black River. And then... I shall have that one attack. Okay. So I'm going to move it there first. Okay. Uh, and attack. Attack two. Here Go comes ahead. An attack. Hey, guess what? Tree damage. It's dead. Um, Vince, you can create a shadow on one of these three hexes. I think you have a, a thing here. Yeah, just drag one of those. Yeah, you got it. And that's the end of the turn. All right. Well, um, all we have to do is deal with that shaman. And by all we have to do, I mean that's annoying. And then the other two. The other room. The other room, yeah, yeah, yeah. Then we have to burst through the gates of the town. Jeez. Yeah. And we've got an annoying debris here. Um I guess... Uh, so the log is difficult terrain? Yes, the log okay. is difficult terrain, and the, and debris... the debris is an obstacle. Cool. Gotcha. Uh -huh. We should... Uh, someone should pick this up, although I'm assuming uh, greed is good. Are, are you going after that? I can. Okay. I mean, they're pretty close to it. So. Yeah. Uh, Clyde McFlatner, what is your uh, battle strategy? Uh, hit him. Are you going to be moving at all? I'm, you don't have to. I'm just curious. I'm going to try not to. I mean, I maybe I could go to that, but you, that's a what? What about that? That's a um. That you can't. That's an obstacle. You can't move on it. Oh, never mind then. Wait. I thought that was loot, or is loot only on the things that are dead? Wait, hold yeah, on. So I think um some assets aren't loading. Fortunately, the hexes do get. Um, bordered. Yeah. But like the log didn't load its asset, the debris yeah. didn't load its oh, asset. Lo yeah, they, the all look, they all look the same. They and all the door. Look like half of yeah. a, but if you hover thing. over them, they'll have a title. So. Okay. Alright, we're gonna have to... Alice, this is incredibly broken. Well, now that what I did you that. Yeah, It's a stopgap. We're playing this week. I don't care how broken yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean... Game. Over that, the magic of the internet. That social this, gathering this big truck here is doing its job it's something you could just dump something on after all oh, that's that's been a while since i've heard that that's false it is a that's series it. of tubes anyways um okay so i can't really I do anything i could move on to that log but i don't have the ability i can have tube but then i can't do the thing all right so yeah what is, what i is just our... stand still and like hit him 
Let's... Hit him in the face. What is our strategy? My strategy is to loot. My strategy is to plagiarize. Let no one else's work evade my eyes. Cool. Remember why the cool. good lord made my eyes. So don't shade my eyes, but plagiarize, plagiarize, plagiarize. Except, of course, to be always to be calling it please research. Okay. Oh, I remember. <laughs> it took you a minute. I, I well, no, I don't. I don't remember what that is, but. I was trying to figure out how to put my cards down there. All right, so. Who, who cares where they come down? That's not my department. Yeah. I love that they put that in uh, For All Mankind when he was a, he's a so show on Apple TV Plus. Um, uh, where the Russians yeah. beat us to the moon and Werner von Braun is in, far, in charge of the space program still into the 70s. But they put the Tom Lehrer song in it, and I was happy. No, I didn't. I haven't seen that. What show is that? Uh, For All Mankind. Have you watched uh, HBO's uh, Watchmen series, by the way? I don't have HBO. Okay, well, at some so, point. We need, to, a, we need to find some time to show you the HBO Watchmen series. It's okay. a continuation of the comic. It's fantastic. Ooh. Like, not of the comic, not the movie. Right, okay. All right. Do you have a... Do you have cards? I'm thinking. Sorry. Yeah, I, would I have been to... looking this whole time. Hmm. Probably don't need any more friends just yet. Yeah, I figure we need to get in that room. It would be nice if I could look at the board and also zoom into my cards. I imagine this is another thing where the mod thinks I'm pointing at something when I'm not. Mm-hmm. Eh. All right, I can probably actually do that. So let's do that. I um, I have some options, but I'm assuming I'm gonna just. Nothing that I'm doing is gonna be contingent on. I'm I'm gonna heal someone and uh, summon a thing. The summon is gonna just go away. All right. Okay, I'm good. All right, so um, we're getting a multi-target piercing hex from the thing. Um, so his focus is going to be Clyde. So he's going to back up, but then he's going to attack this as well. Uh, but he's going to do a multi-target curse. Clyde's going to go at 14. Saul's going to go at 19. Rebecca is going to go at 25. Uh, Brett Bones DMD is going to go at 81. Hi there. Uh, what is popping? Uh, these things are about to shoot. Um, so I guess we're going to uh, do an attack two on the drifter. One damage to the drifter, and the drifter gets cursed. We're going to add that here. Where's the curse button? Uh, we don't have it in here, so what we're going to do is press it over here. I think that'll do it. Hey, it does work for me. And then on the ally here. Oh, no! Da, da, da. They murder that guard? He did. Plus two, two plus two, pierce two. Man, that's no fun. And allies don't and It doesn't retaliate. That's, that's, uh, it does that's retaliate, all. actually. No, it doesn't, because it died. It died, yeah. yeah. Crap. Didn't think they changed that rule. No, they did not. All right, go ahead, Clyde. Well, that's just really unfortunate. Oh, well, so much for me he for healing. Yeah. All right. Well. Come on, Clyde. Actually, hold on, hold on. It would have attacked him with disadvantage. Holy crap! Back that ass up. Yeah. Uh, how do I spawn another guard there? We're gonna do. Excuse me. Spawn. Add number one. Uh. How do we spawn in another guard here? I think it's off to the right side of the board. I got it. Cool, cool. All right. Uh, and cool. All right. What's his number? It was at four, I think. Correct. Fantastic. And now it does retaliate. Hey, what a fortunate turn of events there from remembering the rules. 
It's always a good thing to do. Yeah. Nah. And as soon as I was like, wait, that's wrong. And then I see Sam's comment. I'm Fortunately, like, you've got a chat. Yeah. No, no. I, I figured it out before I saw no, it. No. I mean. Sure you, you did. did. Sure I mean, you, you, you No, did. I did. We all, I, we all believe you. You know it's what? Okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to literally punch you in the face with a. Go ahead, Clyde. Clyde, you know what? You're so great. You're just so wonderful. You're just flattening and drifty. <laughs> oh my god, we flattened it all again. Clyde flattened that guard. That's right. Turn uh, him upside down. That's that's correct. All right, go ahead. Spin them, spin them right round, baby, right round. Um, I'm gonna bloodlet this motherfucker. All right, blow bloodlet that mofo. Oh, this I'm is also, uh, I'm gonna dagger him. Uh, what do you mean by oh poison dagger? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna, cool. I'm gonna dagger the shite out of him. Cool. Uh, poison them. Attack three. Was that minus two? Why did we shuffle again? I feel like that was a mistake. All right, uh, you do poison him. You probably should put a persistent in play. Being a drifter, and that's your core ability. Well, I'm trying, but every time I try and get things shit set up, they move. Just set up on the first turn and ignore everything that's going on. Alice, let him play his class. I know. Geez. I'm sorry. Uh, All right, go, Saul. Uh, I'll just be over here making Tom Lehrer and wrestling jokes. Yeah, fine. Yeah, you, you, got, you got, That's cool. You guys murder the priest. See if I give a shit. I'm just going to stand over here loot and super saying charging up for like 10 minutes. Have fun. Uh, loot. All right, that's your turn. Where in the hell is the loot card at? No, it doesn't matter. It's going to draw for you once you end your turn. Yeah, that's my turn. All right, cool. Uh, you get a lumber and a lumber. Shocker. Yeah, we can build stuff. Yeah, I, I do agree in that there's there's this this room is super annoying for a variety of reasons. All right. Um. I'm going to create a friend and then destroy it. I don't think there's a reason for it to be blocking up the room. And then, uh, Cliff, heal yourself to full. Because I think... I will let you heal me to full. No, wait. Actually, no. It's only range two. Do I do it the other way around? I think I do do it the other way around. Um... All right. I take... Uh three damage and uh, Cliff heals to full and oh, thank you Clyde heals nine and this guard heals one as well yay healing and then um, who's in range is that range three right uh, one, two, three. One, two, three. Uh, do you want your skeleton to move your the Oh yeah, definitely. And anyone, two people who are not me and not Clyde can move three. Uh, who are who are the highest priorities for wanting to move three? I would like to move two. All right, uh, I'll let you move. Go ahead, move. All right, and then. Um, I mean, I probably move the skeleton that can move farthest there. Number this, one. Yeah. Do you want to move at three? Yeah. Right. Cool. Even though he's not going to get to anybody, because you know, stupid obstacle. Yeah, it's this room is such a trash room. Um, go ahead and take your turn, uh, Doctor Britbones, DMD. Okay, so skeleton number one, who I should really name because they killed somebody, so they definitely deserve a name. Moves to there, and skeleton number two moves to there, and it yeah. actually doesn't because there's no focus. Oh, they, they don't. They can't. They can't. There's no path there. Well, I can have them focus me if yes, I want. Yes, they can have them focus you. So this guy. But there's no back. reason to. Correct. There's no reason to. Yeah. Boo. I I agree with you entirely. Um. All right. Well, then I'm going to move myself. Yeah. To there, and then I'm going to curse that guy. You are cursed. All right. Uh, I'm feeling like he's pretty cursed. Uh, uh, Alice, ask your chat what skeleton numbers, number one's name should be. Uh, what is skeleton number one's name? Skeleton number two doesn't get a name because they haven't accomplished anything yet. That's that's correct. They have to earn it. That felt weird to say. 
it's like, uh, and then I've forgotten this now, the name of the, the Space Marine Sergeant who punched Gaskell and his freaking uh, truck in the face and so I... he survived. It's a uh, Yao or It's the one that basically replaced his arm with a, uh, uh, a fist. Hate... Yep. I want to make sure that's active. It is. All right. Now I look forward to naming my mechs when they. Kamasar Yarik. Uh huh. Uh huh. I was like, I know it starts with a Y, because I love that. Oh guy. no no no! It was my my uh, Blood Angel. So, so I mean, yeah, Kamasar Yarik on an army. Oh, you're yes. yeah, that yeah, game. My the one game where you you charged me with a truck and then you charged me with Gaskell and I mean he the, the dude the dude died but not immediately. I like that it took all of your. Uh, all of your space marines shooting Gaskell, him not die, and then your sergeant or whatever marching up with a power hammer just to try and kill him. Yep. Okay. Alice, do you still have Gaskell? Um. I don't know. I'll. I can look later. Okay, because I, I, I thought we gave you. that back. I, okay. I gotta look to see if I still have my. I think some of my minis might be missing. That's fair. All right. But it's hard to tell. Everything's in the car. That's fair. I'm gonna try to move up. I'm not gonna really be able to do anything, but. I'm oh, gonna... Sorry, I should pick those. Sorry. No, I'm gonna. I'm, I'm having move too much up. fun talking to my friends. I know we're weird. I'm gonna be able to move up here, so then I can rest, oh, and then I can kick open the door the turn after. So hopefully this thing will be dead. I'm looking forward to this next, hopefully, wide open room where my skeleton skeletons just do stuff. Yeah, it would be nice to have a wide open room. This room is, I'm going to be honest, this, the, the design for this is fairly trash. It's just adding, adding all these co obstacles and the log here just makes it, it makes it less fun and more annoying, uh, but doesn't really add as much value. don't have the, that many great options to be honest because I can do that okay all right cool and yeah it's gonna be kind of tight here uh, Rebecca is going at 10. Saul's going at 14. Dr. Britt Bones, DMD, is going at 46. Clyde McFlatner is going at 71. And the priest is going to do a very powerful attack for Pierce 2 at 74 after we've all gone. First, Rebecca goes. That guy needs to die. Uh-huh. Uh, does that screw up anyone else's turn? No. Cool. Um, and then I failed to do my formation attack. Wait. No, yeah, I can't. I can... Sweep like Beyonce this. Beyonce is, is upset with you. Yeah, I can sweep. I can sweep around here, but uh, I can't reach out to there with it. So uh, unfortunately, that's my turn. Saul, go ahead. Uh... Saul was originally moving a shadow. You're originally moving a shadow. Yes, that was a plan. Cool, you can still move a shadow. And then what are you yeah, doing? Yeah, shadows can go under people. Yeah, shadows can move through everything. It's on the sheet. Cool. <laughs> I, I love that look. It's a hat. The shadow can also be a hat. <laughs> All right. And then... I don't think that guy's in range of you for to do that attack there. No, he's not. You to the log and then hit him? No, no I can't, I you can't move the shadow in that. Uh, yeah, this uh, this squeezed part of the room is not a friendly. Yeah, it's place. it's it's not it's not friendly. No. Um, I guess that's your turn then. Yep. Yeah. All right. Um. Brett Bones, what happened there? Uh, something failed to load. I don't know what that was. <laughs> it looks like I tried to kill it, but that's. Oh, uh, but it's still it's still in the mod and the uh, T 
TTS, so... All right, number one uh, hangs out. Uh, number two, I'm going to have focus me. I didn't think that through. I should have not moved that shadow there. That's fine. Wait, what? Yeah. It's, it's, All good. It's further. Not, oh, yeah. It's, it's nothing, still... Nobody's drawing a card, so you can just change yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Did you want to change it up? Because you could... Did you, did you, did you want to do the other way around? Yeah, I put the shadow where the guard was just because I'm like, that guy, I've already tagged the priest. Uh, no, you haven't, because oh, once I... you tag, a, once you tag, you can only have one thing tagged at a time. So when you tag this guy to kill it, you you drop the tag on the, the guard. On the priest. Mm. All right, never mind then. And if anyone who's got a cane ear, yes, that is uh, my daughter. Hello. All right. Um, cool. So. Hello, that's, that's... Stephanie McMahon. Huh. All right. So she will. Bones. She will take over my. <laughs> I mean, th that's what Stephanie McMahon's gonna do. Uh, all right. So I'm gonna use the persistent ability on the bottom of angry spirits so the next time one of my summons dies from an attack the attacker will suffer two damage then i'm going to use decaying will uh it's already poisoned so that's an attack it, is this one yes it is already poisoned so that's an attack two at range five all right so it's going to take three of those damages one damage get through its shield cool it's down to two health all right is that your turn that is my turn. All right, Clyde, go ahead. I'm just going to Super Saiyan charge and do both of these. Uh... Cool. Someone over there is telling me to blah, 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 blah. If you want. Blah, blah, blah. To. But uh, it, since the guard's initiative counts as 50, it will try to attack the guard uh, with an attack four pierce two. That brings the guard down to one health. That does mean it retaliates too, which guess what, guys? Do I get these experience immediately for activating nope, this, or is it not? But we'll okay. for, yeah. The guard still takes the hit, but the priest is dead. I think everyone has a combined... Yeah, the priest unaleted itself. Yeah, it's a little janky, this mod. Um, the priest wanted uh, itself uh, gone. Okay. Yeah, it's, uh, just, it's a super janky mod. Now, uh, that just means the next, the next time you perform a melee attack, or the next time you take damage from an attack... Um, those would you'd get an experience for one of each. And then so they start there and they move. I didn't do much of these template things and Gloomhaven, right? Yeah, that's, so that's... I already put this down and then, then... I get hit. And go ah, uh, and then okay. Yeah. All right. Um, are we okay if I long rest and then open the door next round? That's fine yeah. with me. All right. How do we long rest in this mod? That is a very good question. Because. <laughs> I'm like, I know you can press... Is there a longest button up here? Hmm. Hmm. We just we have to do it. it. Oh, God. Um, yeah, I don't see it, but... Um, now, can you make um, Earth? I made Earth. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I wonder if that flows over. It does flow over to it. Yeah, it's a pretty janky mod. I'm going to put a 99 in mine and see if it feeds that in into the, the, the TTS thing. So, uh, anyone else's actions? I am long resting. I am long I'll, I'll add you two. I'm going to take my last two cards actions just for longevity's cool. sake. Uh, and are you long resting or are you going to take your last two cards, um, Clyde? Uh, probably because the only other thing I would really do would be like open the door, which okay. we don't want to do that this turn, right? Correct. Are you short resting? That's right. You choose. Yeah. No. I, 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 oh. I forgot how that worked. Are you Are you long resting? I'm long resting. Okay. Cool. All right. We're gonna try to see if this is how. It... What the heck just happened? Okay. I don't know where those came from, but they are going uh, back over here until I can figure out what happened. Though. <laughs> okay. Oh boy. Where's my discard pile? Your discard pile's right here. Never mind. I... All right. Um, then when you have cards, all right, I'm gonna hit the start button. Hey, it does. It does work that way. All right. It's just you. Uh, 
Dr. Pip Bones DMD at 62. Okay. I'm going to have. Uh, I'm going to move there, and that's it. Um, and you get your uh, dagger back, too, by the way. All right, you're going to move there, and that's it. Yep. All right, end round. Hmm. Uh, something about the drifter, it's, the mod's upset. That's very weird, but... It's me specifically? Yeah, I don't... I'm, I'm assuming there's something weird going... Oh! Uh, has your health over the limit. That's what it is. Uh, I probably hit it one too many times. So which one of these are we going to lose? Mm, Javelin. Although that's going to be good in the last room. We're going to get rid of him. All right. So uh, do we say... How do, does... How does I best deal although that's like my best opener we'll do that then um i'm gonna go orange i'm gonna run into this room i'm gonna throw a spear next turn i'm gonna drop a banner by the way i'm long resting um, okay cool i'm gonna put that into the mod okay so you don't have to worry about that I'm, but I'm going to kick in the door pretty early. Um, I'll be right back. <laughs> and then... Um, so we're going to wait for two cards from... Oh, did you... You did pitch a card there, you go. I think we're good. Uh, until I mean, we're still waiting cards to pick, which is fine. We got three rooms to deal with. Yeah, it's or is that one big room? It's gonna be one big room, but yes. Okay. It's it's at the very least, it's gonna be slightly less crowded. Yeah, I, I I'm not a big. You fan. say, and then it's just gonna be like a maze. Uh, it's that's like one tile. It's, it's, it is, in like... fact, going to be a labyrinth. And we're going to have to save a uh, the babe. The babe, you know, with the, the power. Voodoo. The power of voodoo. See, look, I can make references, too. Sure. Do you have your cards? No, you don't. Why are you drawing on there? I'm just figuring out what the map's going to be, where it's just going to make you, like, run up, walk, run down, rock, run around. How is that? Don't forget to add three obstacles. Yes. Yeah. All right, well, we'll see where that goes. Like, one one, uh, one log right here, so you have to, like, two move, two move, get over, then come down. Oh, actually, I think that killed the... The tea cows are on there. Okay, we're, we'll have to fix this after. Whoops. Kill the you killed the decals? Yeah, the, on the the health. <laughs> That's funny. Uh oh. Oh, they're back now. Okay. All right. Duly noted. Don't press that button. All right. Uh, I think we're good. Uh, he was gonna rest, so uh, I lead the way. I'm assuming that this is how that goes. I still have movement. And this is it. This is the last room. Once we kill all these things, we're good. You good, guys? Guys? Uh. Huh. Uh. Okay, some of them are guards. So that's good. Yeah. All right. Section book. Does it actually open up the page? Two, it does. Three, oh, yeah. Do we have more to read? Yeah, go ahead. Five, six, read seven, us, eight, read us away. We got nine things. It's It's fine. Okay, so we're doing... You run inside the gate, and the breadth of destruction becomes quickly apparent. The town has been sacked. Smoke burns your eyes. What structures still stand are bright with fire, and the rest smolder. 
their frames like black torched skeletons, and all about the wreckage howl the Algox, celebrating their victory in an unrecognizable language. Alright, that's that's all we really get. The short version is this is the last of the room. Uh, we have these four guards, which are on our side. All they're going to be doing is holding up retaliate and shield for the rest of the scenario. Uh, we can save them if we want. And is we have these. The, uh, is it the last of the wilds, though? Uh, it is the last of the wilds, yes. So okay. um, the guards are going to shield up and then do a poison attack adjacent to them. Archers are going to be doing weak attacks but dropping traps, which fucking sucks. Um. Uh, but they're also hey, Alice, why one. are all my cards so good um because Isaac did that and the priests are going to be doing heals but they're going to be operating like AI movement so what's so the range on these isn't this the range forever move one so what defines a melee attack does it actually like a coded word that says it or something the no it's just an attack that doesn't have a range that's correct Okay. If it does not have a range. Yep. Since there's no way I can avoid so the archer's in... attacks. That's just impossible. So even if you're within a melee range, if you do a range attack, it... it... It's, yeah. Your, if yes. your attack has a in fact, off. if your attack has a range and you do it in melee range, you have disadvantage. disadvantage if you remember oh, that. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to just get in here to clear some space for us. Also, I'm going to move... in there, Jeanne Dark. I'm going to move this so we can see With the banner um and i think we'll lock it here okay all right um i'm not dropping my banner this round i'm gonna drop it next round i think um do i want to move it here because then that doesn't leave me good space for the banner drop there but then the banner's in a weird spot um we'll just where do we want me to be for the banner drop I can be in any of these. See, if I if I back up, that's bad. But I'm not going to be avoiding attacks if I back up. Right. Um, but then this guy's going to drop a trap there. It doesn't matter. He's going to drop a trap there regardless. So what do we do? I think we go up here because at the very least we can drop the banners on the side. And which way should we start leaning? Um, probably to the... I almost want to try to go down here. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to start trying to take this guy out. I can attack. It's a weak attack, too, but it's with, um, advantage. Yeah, it's relatively <laughs> symmetrical, but the <laughs> guard is closer on the bottom. So. Oh, full... why is that only an attack, too? Um, guard number... Our Algox archer is down to one health. All right. I create light. And praise the sun. I praise the sun. All right. Uh, those guards are the Algox guards are guarding up. So if you attack them this round, they have shield. These archers are now going to all. I don't think they're going to move at all. They're just going to shoot me. So um, well, it's kind of nice. The guards aren't just sticking us in the door. So that's I correct. That. Uh huh. So two, three, two, two, and I'm going to use my heater shield if I take it. No, thank goodness. Um. Uh, null two three. Um, I have shield one, so that's null one two. Null zero two. I take. Guess what? Two damage. I'm gonna eventually change that back to ninety degrees, but not yet. All right. I take two damage, and then the archers are creating traps. Do we have trap icons around here? Uh. There, I, I think they're probably they're up buzzed. here. These are map tiles, boss standees, character standees, overla overlays, maybe. I'm going to look at what's in here. Uh, oh, it's on the bottom left. It's here. Oh, bottom left here. Once again, it didn't actually load the asset for me, but it says trap. Oh, yeah, I see that there. Okay. Cool. Um, that one has to drop it there. Uh, alas, when there. you drop them, uh, the hex borders don't go so we're gonna have to <laughs> we're gonna have to just pay attention yeah that sucks all right there's traps in these three spots why can't people see these all right this I is really way more know. janky than anticipated all right yeah the pen strategy is a good one 
which spot was it? The one I'm on right now? Uh, yeah. So, they're gonna move to... One... Um... One, two, one... Clyde, go ahead. Yeah. Mark which one the, uh... Uh... Er. And there's one more trap over here, if you want to draw that. Thank you, that actually is kind of helpful. All right, all, all the enemies have gone, so if you can get in there this turn, we do have an annoying trap here, here, and here, but you can potentially get up through here. Oh, that's an open space. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. Oh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, might as well. And then, or oh, hang on. Yeah. I want to be no. correct that, that rubble is difficult terrain and debris is an obstacle? Correct. Cool. All right. Uh, and what's the other part of the card you're doing? Hang Deadly on. Shot and Violent Inheritance, I'm assuming. I think I want to do this. So it's one, two, three, four. Shh. Were you here? I was, yeah. One, two, three. That's three. You have one more. Well, I want to throw a spear at this guy and then try and finish off this guy with the top of the other card. Um, but getting in here is going to be How are you able to do... Are you doing the, are you doing the loss here? I'm doing the bottom, yeah. Yeah, okay. All right, so you're going to move there. One, two, three. Gotcha. Unless, well, no, I'll just get in. Fuck it, because... Cool. And then you're gonna do the attack three on this. Yeah, on the on the guy I'm technically no, the no, guy I'm technically melee. That's uh that's a ranged attack from the, the... I know. I'm oh. aware. Oh you're gonna so do this is what this conversation was. Gotcha. Alright, cool. Draw it with dis made. Draw draw it with disadvantage. Yeah. Let's draw twice, right? Yes. Hey Hey, so it still does what's that? Uh three dam four damage? You know what? Let's poison him too. Okay. Uh, oh. And his number is two, so one, two, and he has he has shield, so only three damage and poison. And he still have the top half of that card, and I picked the wrong one. one is that two, three. is that a milkshake or is that master shake? All right, and now you have a top a half. Okay, cool. Uh, okay, so so are you shake. gonna are you gonna just turn that into a melee attack four, which becomes five because of poison? I was gonna shoot this guy. Oh, shoot that! Yeah, that works too. Go ahead. Yeah, like clear clear him off the map. Sounds good. Fewer archers is always nice. Uh, cool, and that does it. Who's the next? Fantastic, fantastic, very good. So, not Algox got the bomb. <laughs> that was okay. it. Hey, balance this, of powers. I was waiting for him to do it. This is this is really good because I th I don't think we literally need to worry very much about that trap now. All right, um, the guards are gonna do nothing. Saul, it's your turn. We. That's it. I I literally can't do much else. All right. Cool. Um, Brit money. Uh, you get money. You get metal. Cool. You get money and metal. 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 But hey, we cleaned up the first room of uh, coins, so that's actually pretty good. Um, All right. First uh, year see. skeletons. Skeleton shambles gonna focus probably that archer, but it's gonna. Yeah. There. And the there, other one's regardless. just gonna move on the log. The log. Indeed. Yep. All right, and then you heal two from and your rest. Which I indeed do I think that. You were at full already. I was at full. Okay. I'm gonna pull down angry spirits. Okay, cool. All right, so are you dis dismissing one of them? I am dismissing angry spirits, which oh, was the, a the persistent passive. bottom. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it's it's nothing. Gotcha, gotcha. A nothing burger. All right. Um, and then, Alice, I need you to make me a video to tell me in what order I should get rid of these cards, because they're all so good. They are um, indeed all so good. Obviously, I don't actually want you to tell me what to do right now, but seriously, for the channel, now that sounds like a terrible chore. 
I've I've already got a Alice already has an excellent video up there discussing the various bone shaper cards and their uh, uh, pros and cons. So if if you're interested in improving your bone shaper game, as I certainly am now, you should take a look at that. All right. Uh, I'm I'm, I'm too busy playing playing Raid Shadow Legends to worry about that kind of crap. If someone would mind autopiloting for me for a minute, I got to rock my kit down. Okay, cool. Um... Hmm, I don't think I can do anything because there. All right. The real question is, do I drop the banner this turn? Or do I try to fuck with this guard? Which do we think is the better strategy? Well, I mean, ideally, I think we would try to go late and have them go mess with the guards on the other side and then work our way more towards the middle so that the banner yeah, would be I'm more at, at... throughout the rest of the room. Okay, cool. So let's, um, how about I just fuck with this guard, disarm it? Although I, I imagine keeping those guards alive is a good idea for the extra reward. Yeah, yeah, but they've got, they've got shield and they, they do, these, yeah. these shamans are not normals. So, because they are not priests, mm-hmm. or they're, the priests are normal, so they don't have pierce now. Oh, okay. So, yeah, they've got much more Yeah, uh, much robust. more staying. Yeah, much more yeah. staying power this time. Um, so, how about I go up and just disarm and hit this guard so we can work on that? Um, Sounds good. I'll tuka tuka. Either that or go late and try to maybe deal with the... No, I don't want to really want to deal with that archer i shouldn't have pulled javelin if i would have known they were going to drop traps i would have pulled him into it Ugh. um i think we disarmed the guard we disarmed the guard okay uh i think i'm good um Vince was doing something. Do we wanna Uh yeah, go ahead and pick his cards. Yeah. He yeah, has uh fine. wait, his shadow oh his shadow's here. Uh he's uh, he's putting Stephanie to bed, so Right, yes, 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 yes. Uh not that Stephanie, the other Stephanie. I was gonna say long time long time viewers of your of your nonsense Sam. are gonna get. Yes, not that too. not that Stephanie, Stephanie McMahon, who is his daughter because he's Vincent Kennedy McMahon, All right, the owner we're gonna of have WWE. Him just do this the the standard Deathwalker trick. Um, did that go underneath mine? Because I'm that player. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And then uh, Drifter and Bone Shaper. We're looking for your card. Wait, was this your long? Re- you long rested last turn. Yeah, I'm. I'm. I'm back. Yeah, I was gonna I, say like I've gotten yeah, rid like, of Wrath yeah. of the Turned Earth because yes. kind of have stuff next to something for that yeah. to work. All right. Um. Thank you for your art. Do you have your cards picked, though? Uh, in that face. What's Sorry, that? I was drawing. I was drawing burrito crimes. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> oh, now it's Master Shake. That's great. Yeah, yeah, I changed it. He's doing a burrito crime. Yep. Uh, th- thank you for the burrito crime. Uh, let me look at the map again. Now we need Master Shake to. Make oh, a lan- lancer mech so he can be gay do crimes. Yes. Uh, be- being gay and doing crimes is great, though. Uh, source me. How many crimes have you done this week, Alice? I don't think I'm going to actually admit if I even if I did on the channel. Uh-huh. Uh, I've actually been kind of straight lately. It's a problem. Just just say just just tell us the amount of crimes. I, I did. I did match with a dude on a thing. I do, I, I, matching with a dude is pretty straight, right? Uh-huh. Well, I mean, it depends if you're planning on erasing yourself or not. Jeez. Yeah. Uh, I know. Get gay erasure right here. Uh, I'm breaking my streak of dating exclusively non-men. It's a problem. But uh, no, no, no. Buy erasure is a thing, though. So. Yeah, that's what that's I was going problem. for. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, that's what you're going for. I've got my flag. Buy erasure. What, what are you talking about? Maybe uh, I don't. I'll, want to I'll know. explain. I'll explain later. We don't have. We don't have time on the stream to talk about buy erasure. I guess not. And for the, um, and, and some of the viewers are like, 
first off. I'm Loving trying to it. chase as many people off of this stream as possible, Alex. That's, That's right. Fair. No, don't worry. Don't, don't worry. If if someone is getting annoyed at the word gay or bi, I'm, I'd rather them not. Yeah, they shouldn't stream. be here anyway. They shouldn't be here anyway. Uh, like, they're, they're in for a bad time. Yeah, you have a... Do you have a bisexual, You're gonna transgender have a content time. creator? Like, let's be real here. They're, they're in time. They show up to this place. Yeah. All right. We're going to hit the button. Like, you did they're going to go right number. before me, aren't they? Oh, okay. No, that one's not the worst. Um, no, so I was going to I was gonna wait for you to give your total and, and of crimes you've done this week. Oh, and yeah. And then ask, oh. and how many crimes if we were in Florida? Oh, oh, oh. Uh-huh. <laughs> All right, the archers are going to be going, uh, doing their fast shots at 16, but it's only going to be a uh, 2 and a 3. Uh, attack 2 and attack 3 from here, so that's not bad at all. Um, then Saul's going to go, then Clyde's going to go, then Rebecca's going to go. The guards are going to be um, moving 2 and then doing a d an average attack of 3 or 4 and then psyching themselves up with strengthen. Then Brit and Brit's skeletons go. And the shamans are going to be healing everything next to them and also blessing the monster deck, which is just not optimal. Uh, optimal. Yeah. Um, so first things first. Um, Clyde, unfortunately, has the... Uh, the elite likes you. We're equidistant, but the elite likes you better. So, cool. um, that's bring, a, bring. a four damage hit on Clyde. Uh, and then, or you, is it? Do you or have a thing? Is yeah. it? I don't. Or no? Oh no! It's a three a, damage hit. No. Oh, you get an experience. It's actually a three damage hit. Hooray! Yeah. Sorry. No, you're right. It, it is a three damage hit. And then on Alice, I get an attack two plus one minus one two. I'll let you increase my experience because apparently my fingers are like Oh, right, bad. yeah. Uh -huh. we, we got it now. And I think that's all the archers because there's only two. Now Saul goes. If he's not... Is he back yet? Just do him. Just do him? Okay. Uh, moves the shadow up. Where do we... What do we want him to attack? I'm going to let the group pick. You do it. Okay. I don't... Uh, I, I, barely, I, have, I have a very tenuous boom. breath. He, 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 blows, he, blows this, he blows that crap up. The, the elite archer because it's nasty. And he loses his. Oh, he shadow. can just delete something on the shell. Oh, yeah. No, he doesn't. Kill. He doesn't delete it. He just does a good, a good attack. Does he have any bonuses? No, he doesn't. So, um, we're gonna just manually flip. Oh, a mere four damage to the elite archer. It's down to half health. Does uh, does Vince's card look double sided? To anybody else? What card? The ones that he played. I see uh, the back of them. Oh, yeah. Um. Uh, I don't know. Huh, well, <laughs> the, uh... Alice knew what he did, so that's good. Guess you were the uh, one to choose. Uh, move move five, move move a shadow five, and then perform an attack five, gain an experience, infuse earth, and blow the shadow up. So Hey, very nice. So that this elite archer is now, with a crappy draw, killed, dropped its health in half, so... Uh, also, the next time this archer dies, uh, he gets another shadow. Uh, Clyde McFlatner, it's your turn. Uh, um, let's do the bottom. F uh, okay. Give me some advice here, um, cool. card nerd. Because um, basically the whole purpose yes, is to just do, like, do get both through of those, all this motherfucker. Do both of yes. those, yeah. Or yes. you can do that which, and try to... No. Okay. No. Um, well, I don't think... Um, it's up to but, you. No, no, it's it's absolutely this and this. But yes. which order? And explain this before applying other. Um, or do I have to choose that? Or can I choose? Oh, that's not... that's that turns it into a ranged attack. I think you wanted to make it a melee attack, so I don't think you want I... it. Okay, so, so that's optional. That's optional. Yes. Uh, okay. When so... manda mandatory effects are. Do you yeah, see this? They'll have this? the exclamation point. Yep. This this thing right there. These things right here that have exclamation point in a dark frame. That's mandatory. Everything else is optional. So this is an okay. attack three that you could turn into a ranged attack three. But it's an attack three. But then it's a melee attack. So you crush right. weight turns it to a five. Plus it's poison. So that turns it into an attack six. So which one is better to do first? Um, I, I would say do the, I'd do say the do top the, action do the top, first. Just because you could get lucky and just. Yeah. If you, hap if you happen to crit, then you can move afterwards. Yes. Oh, okay. what, what, what he said. That's, ex that's the exact reasoning. So go ahead. Right. Draw it. It got a swing. Swing. Uh, you got it down to two health. And it's got this on your next six melee attacks at two yep. plus. Also, yeah. So that's we already added that in. That's why that was seven damage. 
So I that see. does that does you do move that along though, which you did. Okay. All right, cool. And, and now you have I'm another melee, melee attack four with wound. That's gonna die. Go away. I think you killed it, my dude. All right. Well, I didn't need to disarm it at all because uh, you you uh, nerfed the guy into the ground. I really should have dropped a banner then. You know what? I did play a banner, so you know what, guys? Do we Correct drop the banner? Yeah, might as well. Do we drop the banner? And I can keep moving the banner after that. Um, so here's my options. Move move and help someone move or drop a banner. I think we just drop. I think we do the banner. We're doing it. We're doing the banner. All right. And the next question is, do we move it in front of us? One, what two. What does the banner do? We, we move it up here so I can... Cause so this is the banner of strength. No, no, no. Too. That would move it there, because I'm that. What so is the all, banner? All allies within range two of that banner of strength add one to one of their attacks each turn. Yep, it's a big aura. Fucking A, bro. All right, and then we just pitch that for no effect. Uh, guards continue to do nothing. Algux guards now go. Uh, this elite guard focuses the Dwifter, uh, doing an attack four on him. Uh, that's four damage, three damage because you're a shield. I don't know if that uh, gives you an experience or not. Not yet. So you move that charge over one. And then this guy also strengthens himself. They're all going to strengthen themselves, but after they go. And these other guys are only going to be doing attack threes. Which I think oh, are... Moved. Yeah. So I think first is this guy. He moves up. And then this guy, I don't think has an ability to, so he just moves here. So there's an attack three on the guys. Three minus one is two. So um, no damage, but the retaliate actually bounces two damage back to that guy. Now, could you draw um, green around the large debris? I Sorry. imagine they're more than just the one hex. Um, yeah, they are one... Or you can just tell me where they are. Cool. Thank you. All right. We did it. Okay. It is now your turn. First, your skeletons go. This. Okay. Skeleton number one. Moves I'm up. about to... Moves up there. It has to go on the door, actually, because that's a wall. Ah, uh, I see. And then the and other one. And the other one tries to get there. Yep. So it moves up. And you got it. And now it's your turn. Cool. Okay. So this door is annoyingly packed full of stuff. Yeah, it, it got a little bit of jamboreed, if it will. That's all right. So bottom of uh, return servant to only get there for two, and then I will curse. Did I get hit again and not guy. realize it? Yeah, I, I I thought I said it, but that's okay. Um, oh, it's fine. I just got to move my thing, and I've got the shield thing. Yes, correct. And create the darkness. And the darkness is created, which oh, so I get experience. Like so I get experience when the th when the token leaves. Leaves it, right? Yes, correct. Okay, just to like ingrain that into like muscle memory. That's fair. Everybody, get out of my way! No. All right. Um, Clyde, Clyde, make a kill. <laughs> that guy does heal one, and then we get some more blesses in the monster deck, which is not optimal. And I think that's the end of that round. Hopefully the blesses hit skeletons. Yeah, that would be nice. Okay. Uh, what is Alice doing? Uh, I, I I don't like that um, archer. The best you can. Um, I don't like this guard in front of our face, though. Is Alice figuring out various ways to murder the members of her family? Like turning them into stew or giving them cyanide soup? Correct. How'd you know? Okay. Um, I'm not going to... I'm going to hit the guard in front of us. I'm going early, red. But I'm going to hit the guard in front of our face. And I'm going to try to drop a friend near me to take a hit for the from, so the archer shoots it instead of me. Cool. 
going to try to get my skeletons in there to do some skeleton things. Yeah. Yep. Doing skeleton business. I'm going to go indigo. Are the skeletons going to suicide themselves on a trap? Do it. Is uh, no, because there's a maybe. no, there's a path through there. Okay. Um. No, because there's a path through here, so they think it can get through us. One of us needs to move. Hold on. If that's the case. Uh, do you need me to move so I can we can deal with that better? I don't need you to move. But I feel like you can start applying more damage. So Yeah. What we're gonna do is oops. I don't think the initiative matters. They're both too early, so one of them is correct. Alright, um I picked two cards. Is I don't think I've seen Vince. Get um, by the way, Alice, have we gotten a resp uh, response back on what uh, Skeleton Number One's name is? Oh, uh, I don't think I saw one. We didn hmm. They didn't want to name him. Uh, chat's a little need quiet. To, need to shame we're we're playing chat. to an empty. We're playing to an empty. Uh, empty channel. Uh -huh. You know that. What about no, Sam? No, Sam was there to save us. Sam, Sam. No, there's there's nine people watching. It's not very many, but still, that's okay. We love them. They, um. Uh, they they saw they saw the advertisement for Raid Shadow Legends. Yeah, that that's what caused them to run off. They were like, I could be playing Raid. I could earn an Orc Warrior. All right, so failing that, we're gonna we're gonna name the skeleton number one Jamie Hader because Jamie Hader is Doctor Britt Baker DMD's best friend right now. Is he within range? Not entirely unfair. Yeah, yeah, Timber. We need to name a skeleton. One, two, three, four, five. Cool. He's going to do that. And then what is he going to do with that? Um, that. Cool. Which I think both of those went under here. Is he going right. to celebrate National Brotherhood Week? Yes, he is. All right, Rebecca de Corbin going at six. Clyde McFlatner going at fourteen. Saul at nineteen. Uh, the guards are going to do nothing special at fifty. The priests are going to do nothing special at sixty-two. Archers are going to yeah, power so shot at sixty-four. And then Brit Bones and her skeleton crew, auto knots. I don't know what that is, but I agree. All right, so first thing we're going to immobilize this janky dude in our face. Um, so I need to figure. Yeah, and then do I move away? And so I'm going to do an attack four on it. On the big guard? Yeah. Sadly, uh, three damage. And immobilize. So sad. Uh, Clyde, are you going to move away? No, I'm going to hit it. Are you going to hit it and move away? Uh, 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 maybe. Okay. I'm curious if I need no. to. When's he going? He's going to go at 50. We could potentially, because he's immobilized, just... Uh, hit it, move away, watch it whiff. Because it's going to attack with advantage and there's blesses in there, and I don't like that. I should move away. Yeah, I think we should attack it and move away. So, um... There are some treasures, too, so I think I'm going to move over Yeah, I get here. the further away one, because I'm going to just bounce back up, I think. I, oh, no, no. No, I am not moving away. Nobly. Thank you, Sam. You're no, not moving away? Okay. I'm not. Come hell or high water. Okay. Um, uh, I'm back. All right. We'll move over here welcome, and get this one. Welcome I'm, back. I'm right. brave. I can take it. I get some coins. Clyde McFlatner, it's your turn. All right. So if I understand these new notations of these weird cards. This is an attack. I, attack I two attack plus twice. two. Yeah. With poison so first and then with wound second. So do an attack, right. do an attack four right now with poison, right? And deal the uh, crushing I, wave don't move we, over. Don't we have the big strength banner? Uh, you oh five yeah so it's in a five thank you five. All right. Hey, about about a swing. Okay, cool. And you poison it, and then you do another attack after this. Which is like attack. five again. It's five again. The it doesn't get the banner anymore, but it gets the poison now. So to go ahead and hey, drop it. A swing. Uh, I'm sorry, you may have killed it. 
you do lose that card and you burn two charges, which does give you that experience. Man, oh, I was really yeah. looking forward to my skeletons. Yeah, actually, doing it's something. doing an attack. <laughs> uh, don't worry, they're actually going to move up. Yeah, I mean, and take I a mean, Nobly's already got one under his belt. Yeah, so. they're actually going to take some arrow hits here in a second. So yeah, that's nice. <laughs> hey, hey, thank you. Yes. I I want these elites to go away, so I'm going to make them. Oh, and then I should heal something. Oh, hi, Kristen. Um, and yeah, yeah, the, the soaking hits shaper is great. Um, uh, yep. Who should I heal? Um, probably yourself. One, two, you're three away. Never mind. All right, fine. I'll heal myself. All right, you heal yourself for two? Well, um, yeah, that's fine. All right. Oh, during my turn, I'm going to use my talisman. Forgot that I had that. All right, uh, Saul, uh, I had it set up to where you can attack this elite archer, which you've tagged, to try to turn it into a shadow. Uh, and you wow, can... I can't even see my cards. Oh, you can't even see your cards? Yeah, we had that problem, too. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. Um, can you hit the hover over them and hit four? Then hover over the next one and hit four? Can you see them in your hand now? Are they visible or double-sided? They're now double-sided. Fantastic. Okay. I don't know how to fix that. Yeah, I think you may need to try turning it off and on again, Pete. Yeah, probably. Sorry. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, this, is, this is the problem. Vincent Kennedy model. McMahon? It's saying failed to lose model. Hey, hey at least I didn't say your daughter's name. That's true. I mean, I did. Stephanie yes. McMahon. That's her, her name. So That is. I don't know because I don't know like lore for this. Like, hopefully, yeah. Log back in. Just don't don't involve my kid here. Yeah, don't worry. Oh no! But, I mean, Stephanie McMahon can take care of herself. She is, after all, the chief uh, yeah. chief public relations officer for WWE. So I'm I'm also with Chris. Oh, hey you, fourth of his name. I do like that. But we're gonna do Nobly. Nobly is gonna die here in a second. Can you see the cards yet? Yes. Okay. Uh, the, this one's the one you have within range, and you can get an experience and shoot the thing if you because the dark's in play. And then you can do whatever you want with the bottom. You can do a default move, or you can do the move six. We're gonna oh, I'm it. going to attack it. All right. Go ahead and draw it. Is that a zero? Yes. All right. So it's down to one health. Uh, next damage it takes, it will die. And then you can, do, you can either do that big move and create a shadow as a loss, or you can move two. It's up to you. If you do the move six, you can definitely get to one of these loot tokens. There's here, 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 and here. These are safer because you're not going to get hit. What's the safest for me not getting hit? One of these two. Cool. Is that your turn? Drop a shadow under your spot as well. Yes. All right. The guards go. Uh, you get more coins. Hey, that's that's good. You want coins to retire. Uh, now the guard, the Algox guards go. Not uh, they are going to do nothing special, which I believe. I want coins to retire. Which I believe these go guys both do an attack three with advantage on them. So uh, that's a zero and a crit. So first thing was zero. By this guy. No, don't crit the guards to death. We get more stuff if they're alive. So that's um, one damage and then four damage, which uh, will kill guard six. That guard is a heal. We don't like him. All right. I'm uh, thinking the guard probably doesn't drop loot. Uh, it, does, it, it does. It doesn't. Wouldn't be a, that wouldn't be a heal. The guy who killed him would be a heal. The guard would be a jobber. No, no. The Algox guard is a heal. Oh, uh, OK. I mean, yeah. yes, these city guards are absolutely jobbers. Yeah, uh, they're yeah. local enhancement talent. Yeah, <laughs> yes. We we've just arrived at this new venue, and the local enhancement talent are putting over oh, the local God. heels. The priest blasts spells at them, but they only did one damage to each of these. So that we, too. the triumphant, uh, barn barnstorming baby faces, can look good when we put down these local heels. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Um. One, two, three. That skeleton and that drifter. Or me. That me. That me. All right. It's a uh, you. On me. Uh, ha, ha, ha. Who put a null in there? Who put a curse in there? Uh, I believe that would have been me. Thank you. You're and then welcome. 
I, I must apologize, but Nobly... Wait, actually, do you have Warden's Robes? Do I have what? Warden's Robes. Yes, I do. The uh, first time, do, do it's going like? to take... Uh, get, get that shield. I don't think I can have a choice. I'm pretty sure it just happens. No, no. You can... No, 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 no. You can pick it. But yes, he's taking oh, okay. four damage. And yes, he, I'm absolutely or... going to leave him alive at one. Cool. He is alive at... Nobly survives at one health and takes the shot instead of the rest of us. Um, Way to go, Nobly. <laughs> go, <Scottsman>. Rip Bones. <laughs> do you play... Hey, Scottsman, do you play any uh, Powered by the Apocalypse RPGs? I do. I have not. <laughs> I'm always up for playing any sort of RPG pretty much any time at this point. So. All right. Hey, man. I just sent I just sent you one that I have played before. And, okay, so uh, hold you're, on. You're, we you're have, we have, uh, we have Nobly, saying. and evidently we also have Minesweeper. Minesweeper? So, yes. All right. Let me, let me rename Minesweeper there. All right. So Nobly goes ahead, uh, move two, and then Minesweeper goes after that. Can okay, we name so one I, of them Larry? I think I think he moves going... on top of Larry. Yeah. And yeah. the other one moves on to the door, sadly. And I mean, that's here. fine. I can I can move them stuff, so that's good. Just trying to figure out. So they'll be focusing the archer over there, or... They're, no, they're... I guess the closest is that. Yeah. Okay, uh -huh. but anyway. Um, uh, Nobly, I will... Nobly two hits is now his... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> right, guess he's acquired a title. Can we, can, we get, can we make him? Um, can we make him in, in honor of you being the Scotsman? Can we make him Scottish so he's knobbly Mick two hits? Oh yeah, absolutely. Um, all right, so I'm going to use the bottom of flow of the Black River. I'm going to move myself two, and then I'm going to move a Skellington two, and I think that's going to be Minesweeper because Nobly's going to get to move two here in a second. So Minesweeper's going to move up there. Um, and actually, does anybody want either of those? Tr I guess the top trap, the bottom trap's inconsequential now. Does anybody want the top trap gone for any reason? Um, I don't think so. Unless we can shift the archer onto it. Okay, cool. In that case, uh, hang out there. And then I will use the top of Command the Wretches, or Wretched, to uh, have Nobly move forward. And attack that archer. All right. Go ahead and attack that archer. Go so attack two. Uh, Three damage to the archer. That kills it. Um, Vince, create a shadow in that hex or anywhere next to it. See, aren't we doing a pretty good job cleaning up here, though? I'd say so. Where are these tokens all along the side? Uh, which tokens? So along the left, we've got the various status effects. It's it like, like Snow Corridor. Is that your turn, by the way? Oh, gotcha. So Snow t Corridor is just a door. Yes, uh, that's my turn. Snow okay. Corridor is a door. Um, so all of the ones in between the two... Um, how would I describe them? So everything up that midline, that's all just doors. Anything that has an outline, purple is difficult terrain, green is an obstacle, oh, that's and weird. yellow we is loot. To. But the doors are just doors. You can just go through them. To make a decision, don't I? I have to play this silly game we're playing. Um, let's see here. So the whole middle of this giant room is all open. Um... I'm going to I'm going to heal myself, or I'm going to heal someone. And I'm going to move my banner up, and I'm going to move back. So uh, slow advance, but I'm going to keep my banner in range of all y'all. I figure I'm going to I'm I'm doing something. I'm going to I'm trying. I'm experimenting, uh, where I am going to try to do more of a a leader support thing leader defender rather than that so i'm gonna try to i'm gonna move this banner in a place that's up more and yeah we, we need to for this guy over here or... yeah we, we we probably should have a plan for him well, i guess i can just go deal with him cool you can go deal with them eventually we do, do need to deal with these guys in the back though 
What, yeah, you mean I mean, that, the, that's the, the question. Is like, do you want the, me to the human guards won't just take care of them by themselves? Uh, I, I do wish they would. Uh, if they guess, draw shitty enough, if there's, but they're depending on draws, they absolutely could. But I, I, doubt I guess it. that's my question. Is like, do you want me to advance and try and deal with all this trash, or do you want um, me to go mess with him? It's up to it's up to you. I've got one turn before I long rest. As a, uh, a um, do we think we can take care of this guy here? I would, let's let's work on the guy close to us, I guess. Unless we think we can. Cliff, do you think you got him? Because I absolutely don't. I'm I'm all the way over here. I mean, not reliably. Certainly. Okay. Yeah. Let's. I, let's, can, I let's, can work on him, but let, let, let's clean up this guy and then get some guys up. All right. All right. Um. Yeah, I'm good to go. Oh, I think we're all good to go. All right. Um. Uh, guards. The priests are going to start off early. But going first, they're going to mobilize the guards, which doesn't matter, but doing um, standard attacks. Then Clyde, then Rebecca. The Algox guards are going to do throwing axes, which is the worst situation for us because, oh, their, their strength then fell off, though. Because that means they're not going to take retaliate from the guards. Yeah. Um, and the archers are going to do double shots within range. First, the uh, ranged attacks from these knobs. Uh, minus one and minus two, and immobilize both of them. I'm not going to bother doing anything. Wait, it's... they're knobs? Uh, yes, they are. Uh, Clyde McFlatner, go take us away. Oh. So is my move again? Uh, well, you can move three, three. or move two, and then you can do uh, one three. of. Or er, hang on. You can move three, and then potentially, I don't think there's any enemy within range to get the benefit of that. Yeah. I don't want to do the higher damage though. But yeah, uh, you can... could you could move up, get a coin, and shoot the thing. Yeah. Cool. And do an attack two on that guy. Bang. Damn. Get All wrecked. right. <laughs> okay, he's down to one health. Uh, um, do I have anything? Do I have resources? I don't think I'm so. I'm not within that banner, am I? Uh. What's the rain banner? I think it's range two, actually. Uh, is it two? Yeah, it's two. Sorry, you're out of range of the banner. Oh, wow. But to right now, I'm moving the banner up closer to you, so that's really annoying. <laughs> I'm gonna leave it right next to you. You seem to be doing the most. All right, I'm gonna move here. Um, does anyone mind if I move the banner here? Is that gonna block anything? Not at all. Okay. Um, who? Um, I'm going to heal myself and regen myself. Alright, that's my turn. Your banner did just loot that loot, though. Uh, no, <laughs> According it didn't. To God. No, it didn't. I looted the loot. Oh, okay. Meanwhile, I look at my cards. Oh, did you loot two? Uh, I think there were two piles here, yeah. No, I mean, did you loot too? Because there was a loot under your banner. There was a loot under my ba uh There is a loot under my banner. I see it already. Oh, okay. That's good. Yeah. No, I just looted a single snow thistle, it looks cool. like. Cool. Okay, cool. Unless I'm on drugs. No, you're good. I see it. Yeah. It's it's still there. It's just hidden by the banner model. Gotcha. So. All right. Um, I'm you, Alice. This guy's going to go here. Um, What's the initiative? Actually, they start splitting up here. Because... That guy's got the lower initiative, and this guy's already in range, so they're going to be lazy. So, um, uh, crit, which sucks, still survives it, and this one is plus one. So four, two damage to number five. Where's number five? Two damage, and six damage minus two, four damage to number one. That's still not optimal. Uh, yeah, I hope you don't mind, Tom Lair. I I, I drew uh, a couple of indicators that uh, of, he killed two Algox into oh, his forehead. Of the two, also oh, they scratched it in. Yeah, oh, he's, he's, he scratched in the. It's like the <laughs> uh, kill markers on planes. No, absolutely. Uh, no, this is the, the, the archer is going to first. This archer is going to tag that back and then the banner back. Graffiti is a collaborative effort. That's why I said uh, the banner takes, and left it open. The banner okay. takes one damage. Uh, I don't think the banner has a health bar. Uh, so, 
whatever else can decide. But it's down to three. And says. then uh, two damage, one damage due to your thing. Do you get an experience from that? One damage to... Uh, Saul bad yes. guy? So one damage to Saul bad guy, which also gets you an experience. Hooray. Then Saul goes... Wait, Master Shake, what did I mean? I don't know. I don't know. You don't... You, we don't count that. It's, he's just doing Saul. Saul go. <laughs> Master Shake, what did I miss? Yes, that was one of them. Master Shake, what did I miss? I want to know why Frylock is all little and doesn't have his, his whole self. Well, I don't think it was supposed to be Frylock originally. I mean, it can oh, okay. be. Okay. <laughs> Guys. Okay. Saul Goodman, take your turn. But then also draw stuff. But also Saul, take your turn. Also known as Vince. Well, Alice, you kind of ruined a plan here, but that's fine. What What did I ruin with? You looted. Oh, sorry. How dare you want things? <laughs> that's that's my bad. So uh, materialistic. I'll try not to. Um... That's capitalistic lifestyle. I I'm see. just trying to determine what uh, classic '80s wrestler everybody is. So I think. Uh, I'm definitely like Macho Man Randy Savage the way. I hit yeah, that was here. that was that was my thought, and then I think um, Madam Banner Spear over here is Ricky Steamboat because of all the technical craziness and just overall quality. Uh, I think um, my bone shaper back there is is uh, Ted DiBiase because he just hires people to do his work for him. No, you can put it on the uh, other side. You don't need to just destroy that. Yeah. That gives you an experience, too, for doing that. Money, money, I don't know what the money, hell's going on with the numbers money, all around the Shadow Beast. Yeah, I don't know either. I, I kind of like it. Oh, uh, yeah. it's uh, a, move one, or move three, attack three, but it only has one health, so it'll no, take one No, like, there, there are a bunch of zeros just floating in the air. Oh, I love that. Okay, cool. Yeah. Gotta love glitches. But all right, that works, too. It's almost like... Yeah, so I'm, like I'm struggling with who the Death Walker is. Death Walker. All right, Brit Bones, go. Yum. So I guess this guy actually straight up goes to that uh, priest and starts hugging it. Like I don't know who the like weird supernatural force was in the the eighties. One two three. One two three. It's too early for the Undertaker. When did Sting one, two, three, come four, out? Now Sting would have been. Two, I mean, three, Sting four, at this five. point would have been Surfer Sting. So Sting's not all. Uh, I, I don't think your bones. Uh, it, it's your turn. I think your one bones actually turn. doesn't move though. All right, so because uh, I think he's trying to get there. Nobly, so Nobly, yeah, but I mean, Nobly will. No, yeah, Nobly is but... going to move there because he's got an attack this turn. Oh, gotcha. So he'll focus that guy, but wouldn't that move there because it's trying to go around? Uh, no, it's trying to go through this path to. Three, four. Oh, yep, yep. So, yeah. It's got to focus, but it can't get oh, any Ultimate closer. Warrior, early 90s. I don't know what that is, but you do get an attack, too, on this guy. He has shield yeah, points. I guess he was supernatural, but also the Ultimate Warrior is just a terrible person, so I don't want to involve him in any way. That's fair. Yes, I mean, don't. a lot of them are terrible people. Well, so Macho Man's fine. Ricky yeah, he Steamboat's was okay. fine. The, like, I didn't make you Hulk Hogan, because Hulk Hogan's a te terrible person. Hulk Hogan um, is a terrible person. Okay. Uh, and and Ted DiBiase, despite his sons being involved in like uh, extorting state welfare agencies' money, he's actually okay. Uh, I'm didn't he, use the... like, didn't yeah. he find religion? Uh, you actually draw the attack first. Oh, I do have to draw the attack first. Yes, I'm pretty sure Ted DiBiase like found religion. Yeah, he did, but I mean that's not necessarily a no no recipe for a good like... person. Two damage to. The no, uh, is... priest. One damage after it's shield. Because of his shield. Yep. So then I will use trivia. the top of Angry Spirits to summon a wraith. The, wraith. the wraith's name is going to be Rebel for right now, just because of its relation to Dr. Uh, Britt Bones DMD. Uh, so it's wraithing time. If you could hit that um, persistent icon for I me. I have. Did you want to move first before summoning? You know, that's probably a good idea just so the Wraith can actually do something. Uh, I'm going to use my move four. Let's uh -huh. see what I've got for options. What? How much damage do those traps do? Oh, nice to see you again. Uh, those are three damage traps. 
I don't particularly want to take three damage out of nowhere. So I will move there and then summon a wraith. A shame, because like as a kid, the Ultimate Warrior was absolutely my favorite wrestler. As a yeah, kid. he was a really bad wrestler though, Is even your, before he was a terrible person. I um, was just—I mean, I was also like f four. That stupid. is my turn. Yes. You know. Do I want right. the wraith in front of me or behind me? Oh, um, what about the big boss man? Who who would be big boss man? Ooh, I mean, that would also be you. Is the problem? Because mm. he was always a upfront, you know, beating people up guy. He wasn't yeah. a guy who who was teleporting around all over the place. That's true. I guess same sort of thing with like Jake the Snake. Mm. Mm -mm. That's the answer. Jake the Snake. It, Pete is Jake the Snake. Hey, Sorry. I was I was literally oh, just your yeah. shadow. You got a big snake. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I was literally just looking at the Jake Death the Walker snake. is Jake the, Jake, Jake the Snake. That shadow beast's name is Damien. All right, yeah. cool. I'm gonna heal all allies. Shh. Although all allies, a limited range. I do think that nails. Yeah, that's guys. great. Yeah, it does. <laughs> hey guards, inspirational Alice over here at all costs. Jean Dark I'm holding her, say it out loud, holding her banner. I don't know what it means. Dark element for the wraith. It is in. It is active. Yes. Dark element. Uh, yeah. Um, that's I mean, it's, Yanni Limatainen. Oh, yeah, we love Yanni. His, All right. It's his second best solo project. Uh, yeah, that's that's fair. I mean, it's hard to beat Kane's offering. That's so good. Yup. Um, but uh, I've got like 15 minutes before I guess we're getting ready for work. All right. Cool. All right, let's. let's we gotta kill out. the rest of this room. Kill the rest of the room in fifteen minutes. Go pick cards. Um, I sleep. I'm going to. Oh, yeah, sorry, you're... I'm having too much fun. Yeah, that happens. Sorry. Uh, no, all good. All Cl good. Clyde's long resting. I've got you plugged yep. in. Um, Saul and Britt. I think I've got a long rest also. You have a long rest too. Cool. All right, I'll plug you in. So it's just Britt. If you can undercut your their initiative, you might be able to get the Wraith to hammer one of them. Yeah. Yeah, that'll work. Yes, uh, Kristen is right. Naming the skeleton helps. Absolutely. He's all right. he's all energized now. Um, no Nobly's killed two dudes, Rebecca, as you can see. <laughs> Rebecca starts us off. Yes. We, 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 we've got this good stuff. Um, the uh, priests are going to angry hex. That's they're going to multi-target attack, but it's weak. But it is cursing. Uh, the Argox guards are doing weak attacks, but they're going early. The archers are also going early. But first, Brit Bones before, goes before both of them, and then we have some long rest. So first, Rebecca, who's going to heal one and then take a bunch of damage. All right, how many people are hurt? Do I have to target all allies? Yeah, uh, I have no to. No Nobly's hurt. All right, hold on. One. Two, one, two. Three, now you gotta count in French because you're French. Four, five, six. Okay, that's brutal. But uh, heal Nobly back to full. Yay! Um, oh, oof. Sorry. Yeah. What? The the amount of damage you're gonna take. No, I six damage. <laughs> I take six suffer six damage. Yeah. Uh and three damage I, I, I just healed I think it was sixteen health. I, I traded six for sixteen. Yeah. So it would have been eighteen, but some people were close to, closer to max. I also get an experience for doing that. I mean that's what you get for being the chosen of God for France's glory. Uh huh. And we move over here and scoop this up, I think. Are any of them going to be attacking me or the guards? Attacking the guard, attacking the guard, attacking that double attack. It's going to shoot me for a weak hit. Uh, we like this spot. Does this spot fuck with anyone else's turn? I don't think so, because I don't think Brett's going there. Nope. Cool. For the glory of the party, I get some money. Um, for God and for France. For God and for France. All right. Because um, the banner spear is Joan of Arc. In case that's correct. Hadn't noticed yet. 
Yes. Um, so it wants to attack Nobly more than anything. And then it moves away so it can do an attack on both of these. So um, attack on Nobly first. And then on the guard, no damage to either of them. Uh, you do get a curse. I've been cursed. Yes. And then here, one, two, uh, on me as well. Yeah, so. It's going to be you, yeah. Um, on the guard, zero damage, and then two damage to me, which is one. And I do get a curse. This is cursed. That is cursed. Uh, that's both of them, I think. So Brit Bones first. Uh, your thing goes, which will move up to the... It has to move up to that spot. Or Can that spot, actually. It works, that works, too, yeah. And then it attacks the... It has to attack the priest, sadly. Okay. So, attacking the priest. Where's that banner? Very far um, away. Very far away, sadly. Attack two. Four uh, of those damages. So, three damage goes through to the priest. Indeed. One, two, three. It's down to and two. And then we got Minesweeper, who's probably going to focus that archer. Uh, Minesweeper. Uh, it's not going to move and regardless. it's not going to move again. Yeah. Slew. Uh -huh. and, and then the Wraith is going to move there, and it's going to be within range of the banner. I do or there, there, to the Wraith. The debris. Yep. And then it's, it's, gonna... it's flying, it can hang out there without dealing Attack with two that. On the Attack two on the archer. Attack two on Yon Archer. Yeah. Two minus one. one hey, the damage. banner! <laughs> Enough to do it. That'll Good job, it. Rebel. Banner, banner chalks up another win. Good job, Banner. What's the banner's name? Um, um, <laughs> Valjean. I don't know. Yeah, uh, that's a good French and, name. And now you have two cool. cards to play. That was just your free actions. Indeed, I do. Banner serial number 24601. <laughs> yep. <laughs> uh, the palace is good. Oh, hey, Ben. Um, the party is going pretty well i think we're doing i think we have a really solid for i think just completely learning i think most of the people were looking at the cards for the first time or half yeah yeah oh half, yeah half just looking anybody, at it for the first time we're anybody planning on moving to where the bone shaper is at the moment uh is it the new turn no well uh, we are about to do long rests in a second oh okay honestly i, th I think the the healing everything to just to do that i'm like i feel really good about that all right, so that was bottom of fell remedy to move there. I'm going to need to recover real fast though. though. Decaying will. So uh, what's so this large snow corridor? It's corridor? just flat terrain. Corridors are just it. yeah, it's just open. Okay. Yeah. They're they're doors essentially. The middle is all doors. All right. Yep. I'm going to attack the guard. So. Uh, for one and poison. Which is and then plus one two. if it's adjacent to one of my summons. So it's an attack two. And you get create rid earth and poison. Two damage. Two damage to the, you said this guard? To the guard, yes. yes. Don't want to deal with that shield. Uh-huh. So two damage and poison to that guard. Fantastic. I love how then some of the light developers are coming in and are like, what are these guys, what are they doing to the board? Yeah, 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 yeah. We, we, we don't know, but that's, is that, that's your turn then? That is my turn. All right, sounds good. Uh, guards are going to hasty assault. This guy is going to move over to this, uh, do an attack too. No damage, but he does get retaliated. Uh, Nobly is going to get uh, possibly his face smashed in. Come for on, Nobly. One damage. Yes. <laughs> Nobly make three hits. <laughs> you have Nob to write in. I, I, love, I love that Nobly has now soaked three hits for us. <laughs> you have to write in what uh, Nobly's uh, catchphrase is over here. Uh, oh, that's, that's great. That's, that's, uh, I just love that. That's, that's, your, that's your thing, Scott. archers are dead. So the guards, okay. Um, everyone who is, oh, Clyde now heals the remaining two for his long rest. And then, so I get to move my uh, wraith. Your wraith is the closest path is to there, so you move three up to that. So just shy. Yeah, the Skele, Skele boy is doing really well. So, uh, and I think that's the end of that round. Got a few of his teeth out, considering he just keeps getting beaten to the face okay uh can i do something with this turn that won't backfire T -t um oh that will absolutely backfire that will be that will be bad 
Uh, do we leave this banner back here? We might have to. As much as I wanted to tow a banner, uh, I think we just try to clean up back here. Um, what's everyone else's battle plans? Long rest. Long I'm rest. Up there. Well, I mean, I there's only four dudes alive. I should probably think about short resting, I suppose. Uh, um, okay, so the long rest is over, so I should be at full health and everything. Uh, you, you well, did, not yet. Not full health. long no, rest last turn? Yeah, his long rest is over, so. Oh, gotcha. You don't heal to full health, but I did heal you to eight, and then you healed two from your long rest, which healed you to full health, so. Yeah, that's what I meant. That's what your face meant. Uh, so I can delete this priest, but I need some help because I'm going to take a hit from that priest, I think. Yeah. Um, which I'm at two health, but I can basically delete this guy. I will be appearing next to that priest. I'm going Are you to going pretty... short rest. Are you going I'll be... early? I'm going to be uh, appearing probably about... This one? Do you want this one to go away? Yellow to orange. You know... Uh, fortune favors the bold. Fine. Uh, this, if we can deal with this one, I'd be great. That would be great. Okay. I'm going to short rest. I'm going to pull down, uh, Minesweeper. Cool. And I lost Command the Wretched, which is not Unless great. I go late. Oh. Should I go late? I, honestly, I think we might go late just for the safety purposes. It's within banner think... range, right? Where's your banner? No, it's not. Banner's there. It's not. I haven't moved it. But I still have all this stuff. Regardless, uh, the banner did result in, honestly, the banner with the, the aura for the first part and that last thing. I kind of added up. The skeleton added. Man, that was, that's been so much to durability purposes. Because otherwise, if that guy was dead, he would have actually marched over and started hitting us. Or, no, actually, he would have marched over and started hitting the guards that we're trying to protect. It's the green again, or are those traps? Uh, greens, green uh, is obstacles. Ob yeah. Okay. So you can't move through them. Red is traps. Um, purple is difficult terrain. And gold gotcha. is loot. Okay. I love how we have such a decorated board, though. Uh, we should just do this every time, just like yeah, I mean, everyone. It's gonna first. happen. Just clear don't it. Worry about that. Clear, clear it, and then do another sketch every session. All right, that works. Uh, make no, sure you no, make no, no, no. make no. sure you no. Well, no, it, it it'll get too muddled if we write over it every time. But uh, Alice, you definitely have to screenshot. All right, we will. Oh no, 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 no. I mean, do it for like two or three sessions. When it gets to it, then okay, we spray got it. it. Okay. Yeah, we don't even. But we don't. But like in true uh, graffiti fashion, we just spend time painting over it. Yeah, okay. yeah. With with like white, so like a little bit of it bleeds through. That that's fair. All right. Yeah. I agree. Yeah. I'd say if you can, the only thing I can do is like do initiative undercuts and try to see if you can do something good with the other card. Right. Even then, uh, yeah, oh, screw it. I'm going to give you a little healing. Cool. Well, I think. That sounds good. All right. Uh, Brett Bones is going to be going first. The shaman... Oh, the priests are healing. That sucks. Uh, but they aren't attacking anything, so that's neat. Um, then Clyde, then Saul. Then the guards are going to be psyching up. Uh, so they're going to do uh, nothing special but lower move, but they're going to strengthen, and then I'll end the round. So first thing, you... Brett, Brett Bones, take us away. First, oh, they, they Nobly will hit the priest Okay, Nobly. Go get him. Get a plus one. I didn't. Okay. Hey, one damage. One damage. And then, um, uh, Minesweeper, where is he? So, Minesweeper, I pulled down. So, okay. the Wraith is Wraith, up. Wraith up. So, Wraith goes up to there and shoots this priest. Still in range of the banner. So, attack two on it. Attack two. Two 
damage. One right, damage. So one damage after its shield. Hey, damage is damage. Yep. Uh, then I'm going to hurt myself too and heal Jean Dark for five. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. And make that darkness happen. You do indeed make that darkness and happen. And then I just used Flow of the Black River for a uh, initiative boost. But hey, I just hurt myself, so I might as yeah. well heal myself. Correct. So you just heal yourself back to full. Indeed. Cool. That's Unfortun my turn, folks. Unfortunately, the priests now go. 5-5, five, five, they're equidistant. So I think this guy just heals himself back to full, which is okay. Um, and who does this guy heal? It's equidistant, uh, equal amount of health. I think he just targets himself. I think actually, actually up to us. And I, do we want heal to the heal, heal, guy. Heal, heal, heal the poison heal, guy? Heal, heal the poison guy. We heal the poison off. So all it does is the poison goes away, which I think is a perfectly fine trade off. Yup. Then they, that's just their turns. They don't do any attacks that go Clyde. Uh, um, Oh, he moved. That's unfortunate. That is really unfortunate, yeah. One, two, three, four. Never mind. Okay, cool. Four, and then what are you doing? An attack five? Yep. Yep. Does that give you an experience? I forget where your charges are. It does. Uh, uh, yes. It does. Cool. Uh, draw an attack five. All right. After its shield, that's four damage. It's down to two health. How did, I lose to health? How did I lose two health? Um, I don't know, oh. but you shouldn't have taken anything yet. So maybe I—I yeah. I probably misclicked something earlier. Maybe gonna... you hit, you hurt him instead of me. Oh, probably. Yeah. All right. Is that your turn? You will loot at uh, the end of it. Yeah, I guess. Let's see cool. here. Move three. Was uh, it, or move four. You got some hide. Yeah. Yeah. So that's good. Go ahead, Saul. Uh, first, your uh, your thing goes. It has to go ahead and attack this priest. Go ahead, draw that. Uh, priest is dead. You get a shadow for it. Oh yeah. Hey, what? yeah, you, you you killed the priest oh, and turned it into a shadow. So I think that's a good trade. Good job, Damien. Yep. And then now you actually take your turn. Teleport adjacent to the other shadow. I yep. still want to know how they had an actual cobra bite Macho Man, and he didn't die. It could have been. Um, I you... presume they like had they milked out all the venom beforehand. You can still, remove venom geez. glands. And the top part of my other card, and I am tossing shades, and shadows everywhere. All right. Toss out three shadows. Well, uh, while you decide that, we'll just keep moving on. The game does. Um, the game actually does pretty well in two players, in my opinion. We've played several scenarios in two player just because we missed people. But yeah, I'd say say it does. So um, we can move those under them here in a second. Uh, they none of the guards move. They just fight whoever's in their face. So first, this guard will punch Nobly. Oh no, um, Nobly takes five damage. Don't worry. He'll be back. All right, Nobly's gone. Man, that was nice. That was a very he's not. He's not gone. He's just discarded. He's not gone. He's just discarded. He's, he's but never the gone from, is, from our hearts. Know, so. He's never gone from our hearts. And oh, that's... did you happen to get my experience for summoning that uh, spirit that I summoned I there? I don't know. Uh, go ahead, add it. I think I may have missed it. So. I can't click buttons or the thing will explode. Oh, yeah. right. Yeah, okay. Okay. But I also don't recall having done anything else that would have given me experience, so I think four might be the right answer. I don't know. I'm sorry. We'll find let's out. Just let's just stick with four. Okay. And then this one does an attack three on the guard three minus two. Uh, guess what? That's, it's, it, it's still alive. It's still alive. Bounces two damage back to that dude. All right. Yay! Rebecca's turn. All right. Um, and uh, sweeping in a cone here, which will do an attack three on that guard. 
three damage, I think that's enough to take it out. Hey, I'd say that's more like of a cleave than a cone, personally. Yeah, but. cleave cone. Cleave cone. Hey, semantics, you know. Yep. All right. I, I, I feel like, like we're doing a really good job on this scenario, guys. I mean, nobody's dead except for that one guard. So. Oh, it actually didn't loot that time. I think because the shadow may have screwed up with uh. it. Ah. And somehow the shadow got eaten there. Yep. I don't know where it went it's to. Gotta be, it's got to be hyper vigilant. Probably went back in the infinite pile of shadows. Um, I'm going to just draw this for it. Okay, there it is. Go ahead and we're going to pitch this. I'll just remember where it is. There's a shadow underneath me. We can put it here and shortly. I think I'm going to short rest because I think we just want to clean up. I think I'm going to finish the map the fight. Finish what? I'm going to finish the round. It's going to finish the fight. Okay, cool. Guys, he's going to finish the fight. He's going to finish the story like Cody Rhodes. He failed at WrestleMania last year. Well, this year. We'll see if he manages to do it next year. Do, do, you, have the, do you think you have the ability to um, like, just do it? Do it. Me? Yeah. No, okay. I'm pretty sure I can finish this up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. With the shadows under those two dudes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. All right. Okay. So should I... Uh, would you say get that experience. I should just scramble for as much experience as I can? Get experience and get coins. Um, your thoughts on the Gloomhaven button and bugs? Um, that's actually pretty neat. I, uh, I had uh, access to it for a bit. Uh, Gloom Holden's pretty cool. Uh, I think, I think it's a neat concept for people that maybe want a lighter experience, which kind of this game is a bit heavy. We're going to yeah. go ahead with this. Um, so what are you doing? You're going to wound everything and blow up one of them. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, uh. And move my shadow to kill. Yeah, that sounds good. Um, what we're gonna do is, does, what's the um, is there any specific loot? I'm gonna dismiss this banner. So if you guys want that loot, oh, we can't coexist with your banner. No, I can't. Um, oh I, wow. Should I just get this loot? I think I just get this loot and heal. Who's not at full health? That I guard. think it's to you. That guard, or, yeah, yeah I don't right care. Guard. I'm, I'm just healing the guard. I get an experience for that. And another loot. Uh, lumber. All right, Clyde, go ahead. Clyde, um, if you could not kill that guy. Which guy? The, the priest guy's... you're next to. That was kind of what I was planning on doing. But can, I, can I beg not to? Why? What's Reasons. It, what, what's in it for me? I'll. I will grill for you the next time you visit. Oh, mm -hmm. can you grill for me? I'll. Uh, I'll give you Viking's blood in August. Wait, do you want me to kill him? What is this, is no, this I want you to. I no, want no, no. to kill him. No, I'm. I'm saying like. Scotsman said, "Like he'll give me Vikings blood." Yeah, I'll give you. I'll give you Vikings blood if you don't kill him. Oh, if I don't kill him. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh yeah. So I'm not. I'm not counterbidding. That's what I thought. Okay, I so, oh no no no. All right. So. Uh, all right. Well, revised plan. Let me think here. Uh, is there anything else to not? You could kill? just loot if you wanted to just loot. Ah, uh, uh, so boring. I know it's boring. Um, I don't know if you've got a. You do have a I'm just saying, attack. this scenario is entirely absent of any Vermlings. That's so. true. What the heck is going on, is, Isaac? Is, is that your turn? I guess, unless I can do something else, which I'm being advised not to by legal, you know. You, you, get, you get some snow thistle. Yeah, legal's hey, leaving. You're, you're being bribed. Saul, so go ahead. Don't get it two ways. You're being bribed. All right, first, that thing go ahead and attacks it. Um, that kills it easily 
and now um uh, bam bam go ahead draw it i see you looking bam. at my graffiti up here scotsman i just want you to know andre the giant has a posse yep okay. I, I saw in it. my move and i pick up the loot cool uh you get some lumber cool uh brett go ahead Okay, I'm going to resummon Nobbly make three hits with the top of Return Servant. What was that? Slayer, kill two or more enemies in the same round. Aha! I see. Very give good. Me that, give me that experience there. I and did, then, I did. excellent. And then I'm going to pop over here. And did you give me an experience? Uh, no, but I'm doing it now. All right. Okay. I got to tap out and get ready. Yep. Cool. Yep. Thanks, Vince. Bye. Um, See you, Vince. Oh, when you end that, it doesn't do it. So we're going to do this last draw for you. Metal. Appropriate. Uh-huh. If only any any of the metal would come to within four hours of where I live. All right. So um, let's go read the end text, which is, I think, I think we actually have to flip to it. I think it's nine. Hey, it's a small sheet. Nine, nine, one. Oh, yeah, so small. All right. You lower your weapon and breathe. So the remaining Algox retreat, scurrying from Frosthaven like giant white mice. Muscle. They'll be back. You're certain of it. But for now, you can rest. You wipe the, wipe the soot from your face and take stock. Frosthaven is almost exactly what you imagined. A knot of gray stone and timber surrounded by sharpened palisade walls, a place where mere survival is an everyday concern and where only the desperate could feel at home. Thankfully, though, the townsfolk are tough. They've ar they're already on their feet, dousing fires and picking through rubble. In fact, one of those townspeople is marching right for you, a sharp-featured human woman with a fighter's muscular build, close-cropped hair and dark skin, approaches and offers a gauntleted hand in greeting. The sea be praised, she says, crushing your fingers with enthusiasm. We wouldn't have held out much longer without you. You'd nod and ask what happened. Oh, just life up north is all, she chuckles. I'm Satha, mayor of this fort now that my predecessor and his lieutenant have fallen. As for the Algox, they've been at us all winter. Took them months to break through, but they finally did. Killed a dozen or so of my people, and wouldn't have done worse if you hadn't shown up. You explain who you are, that you've been sent from White Oak. At the mention of the capital, her face scrunches up in displeasure. It's about time they sent someone to help fix this mess they made, she says, then tries to lighten her mood. I don't mean to be ungrateful, I'm overjoyed to still be among the living. But a lot more people would be alive if your employers, the Merchants Guild, never stuck their noses in our business. I've stuck me whole, spent me whole life here in what was once a fishing village, living and letting live with the Algox. Until last summer, that is, when the Merchant Guild sent some garrisons and bureaucratic types up here to see how Frosthaven could be more used to the Empire. One of their expeditions proceeded to muck about in an Algox burial site. The next thing we know, righteously angry Algox are attacking us. The ink stains immediately hightailed it out of here, leaving just a handful of soldiers behind to keep us safe. Satha clenches her gauntlet tighter and tighter as she tells the story, but now releases her grip. I've had to learn a lot of things in the last year. The hard truth is that the Algox refuse to be reasoned with, and the only way to stay alive and keep this place I call home is to win the fight, regardless of who has started it. Her face softens as she clasps your shoulder hard. There's not many of you, but I'll take what I can get, especially now that our garrison's been thinned, and as it happens, I have an idea. She turns and gestures to the town's smoldering walls. We took a beating in that fight, so if we're going to survive much longer, we'll have to do more than just sit around and wait for the next attack. She sizes you up carefully. I already sent a scout to track the Algox back home to the mountains. 
drop your gear at a longhouse that's still standing and rest up. As soon as you're ready, I want you to get over there and find a way to slow these attacks. The bunks in the remaining longhouses are all occupied by the injured, but you find a dry stretch of floor to lay your heads on on your packs. You doubt you can sleep after the horrors that greeted you in this little outpost, but before you know it, a young Valrath man is nudging you awake. Satha's scout has returned with his report. He tracked the attackers to the foothills of the Copperneck Mountains, where they entered a cave at the base of Snow Scorned Mountain. Interestingly, a smaller band split from the main group before they reached the cave and hiked around to the mountain's deadly eastern face. The scout didn't see where they went, but he suspects a secret entrance to the Algok stronghold. One last thing, the Valorath said as you wipe the final dregs of sleep from your eyes. Another group was moving towards Snowscorn. They were Algox, no doubt. But they're dressed differently than the ones who attacked us. They carried long sticks and had some wild animals with them. I don't know if they're going to attack the mountain or reinforce it, but either way, you'd better get there quick. Rewards gain uh, several morale. Six we morale. Save a lot of six, six morale. Hooray. And we've got Algox Scouting, which is at the Deadly Eastern Face, or Algox Offensive, which is at the base of Snow Scorn Mountain. And we will now perform an outpost phase. All which right. Ellis knows about, and we don't. All right, mm. so first I'm going to um, go through the um, looting things. What is it there? Okay. Um, on your sheet. Let's let's do it one at a time. Uh, I think um, Vince has fled for us, so we'll hey. do we'll do those ones last. Um, so first the um, Clyde. So that's one hide. Do you have? Should I add it all up? Yeah, I don't care. Whatever. Yeah, I mean we can't flick buttons. So. Uh, oh, that one should have been you too. Yeah, so we can't even actually... see what you're. Like the, the audience no, can't. All right, all right. Uh, three hide and um, one snow thistle and uh, two gold. So um, on your sheet over here, uh, bump your gold up to two. Doing things. Uh, okay. Bump your hide up to three. And uh, add one to your. Snow thistle, I think. Snow thistle. Which one is that? Uh, that's the. Oh, sorry. That's uh, this. The the bottom right. Yeah, you got it. Uh, cheers, Timber. Um, Bone Shaper. You didn't loot very much, did you? I looted one thing. Uh huh. Uh, I think you have just a metal. Also, my. Also, your what? My my thing. My goal. I I. Oh, okay. Um, uh, did you get it? I think so. That's never why I never left. Hex. Never exited je uh, Oh, leave a hex. Oh, oh, I get it now. You're like, ah, oh, screw it. I'm not fleeing. I've got this. I'm not yes. going to Yeah, I'm you get two away. check marks. I ain't, That's I ain't good. No, I ain't no pussy. All right, um, so. Where um, did I put those again? Uh, Up here? Uh, yep. In the perk things? Okay. Two no, lumber. I didn't do any attacks in the first three rounds. Two I ain't no sissy. And a metal. And then two gold. And then the next row, more gold. Um, and then the next row, more lumber. And, okay. Um, is that all you got for the gold? Yes. And then Alice get Let's start with the top. Um, one snow thistle and a lumber um, and a hide. Then the next row. A s oh, no, that was your snow thistle. So this is my snow thistle. And then four gold. So let me make sure. One lumber and a hide. And then Snow thistle, next row, just a lumber, 
and bottom row gold. Okay. All right. Uh, we have now added up. Also, I got my thing. Uh, two check marks. It was kind of screwing me up because I needed to change things up, but it's never actually perform a basic action. So some of the cards are oddly specific, so I was forced to do, like, thing. It, it worked out okay. Also, for my um, quest, I'm at 10 out of 150. So I need 140 more experience from cards. Um, so that, I think we've, did we add up the loot? Also, uh, experience, um, Peter's at, oops, uh, at 11. Did you get six plus your total, Cliff? For yeah. experience? Yes. Not so yet. six. So uh, 11. You get 11. Both of you get, uh, you, you all get 11 experience. So go ahead and mark that on your sheet. So I think that's rewards. And then I think we go to the outpost phase. So the first thing is, it's a five point phase. I'm just going to point this out. Uh, Jesus. First, it's, it's not, it's, it takes significantly less time. It's advancement of time. There's sometimes there's going to be a sheet up over here. And sometimes there's going to be text on the sheet and sometimes there's not. As you see, it's really blank at the start. Yep. But um, that, so. I'm going to be right back, sorry. That's fine. Uh, and the next one, we're going to do an outpost event. Which is there. I think we already split it out. Yes. So we'll have Cliff read that when he gets back. And then we'll do building operations, which I don't think we really have any at the moment. We do not. Uh, we do have soldiers. I wonder if there's buttons for those. There are. Cool. We do start with four soldiers. And then we do some buying or crafting. We can't buy stuff right now. So, but we can craft stuff with these items. And we're going to need to build a building. Uh, if you want to look at items, available items, we have items. I don't know if you wanted to craft something with what you got. Uh, oh, what can I craft? Uh, anything in this stack here. What stack? Wonder, can we can we put sort here? Uh, oh, that just sorts it. Okay. Uh, this stack, but you can like hit right click and hit search, go through it, and then hit alt to like hold over cards, if that makes sense. Uh, I did uh, not get enough leather, so I need to hold on to that. And then we're going to figure out, how did they do this? Is there actually charts on this? Oh my god, they added buttons. That's fucking neat. So we can build walls or a new upgrade. Upgrade. Okay, cool. So I'll make some boots? So uh, about crude leather. boots? Yep. This. All right, so you add crude boots to your items. And I take away two leather. Two leather. Two you got it. You got it. You, you've figured right. it out, my dude. That's one of them I wanted to craft, but I didn't get enough hide because you got all of it. That's perfectly fine, by the way. I'm glad one of us got it. I mean, I can just... Oh, uh, we can make a potion. Run. We can make a potion if we combine our powers together. Are we allowed to do that? Yes, we, we are. We allowed in Frost Haven. Yeah, no, potions is the exception to the rule. Um, we'll have to steal one of uh, the Death Walkers, and I'll just steal one of mine. And we have the chart here, which is Rock Root... This is the only potion we can make right here, is over here. Rock root and silver leaf. Renewing potion 92. So how do we get it once we've unlocked it? Do you see this chart over here? Oh, what? It okay. certainly appears to be a chart. Do you see uh, rock root and silver leaf? These are the two herbs we looted. So we combine them to make a renewing potion. Does this chart make sense? Jesus Christ, okay. <laughs> yes. Okay, dude, this this game is a little uh, ridiculous. I'm very this, this, aware. This, yeah, they they went a little hard on this, but okay. Um, renew. Well, I tried. I was like, that looks cool. Uh, renew. Oop, what the? There's no renewing potion in there. Oh, cause it's numbered. 
Here we go. Okay. Zero, zero 092. Yeah. It's, I was like, I know it's cool. So first off, this gets added to our craftable items, but now one person gets it. But since when we brew, we can pick who gets it. During your turn, recover two of your spent items. I personally have two spent items. I could use that pretty well. Uh, so could the Death Walker. Um, Bone Shaper still could, even though there's only one. It's still good. Honestly, we all could. Who do I'd we say one of the one of the people with who has two, two. that they can use. Um, wait, hang on. I'm confused. What now? We have a so have a, it's a um two. It's a, it's a potion that lets you recover two things that are tapped. It's oh. yeah on TTS. Yes. Um, um so I'll take be, it if I've no one three. wants it because I'm greedy. I've got three things. Yeah, if you want to take it, I'll say go ahead. Then uh, you're up to four. Also, uh, if you want to read this outpost event. Sorry, uh, ping it again. Thank you. All right, outpost event. A pretentious looking visitor scolds Captain Olmstead. Hey, that's a name. That's my hey. second name. Shouting for all to hear in the barracks yard. Shameful. Just shameful. Is this how you greet an emissary from White Oak? It's a wonder you survived this long at all. The condition of this cap. Cap. Conceivable. Outpost, sir. Captain Olmstead interrupts. The visitor looks flustered, then spots your ragtag group. And look at these miserable guards. They aren't even wearing standard issue armor. We're not. Option guys. A, excuse me? We're not guards, we're mercenaries. Option B, fall in line and pretend to be guards. I would definitely vote for pretending to be guards. Really? Um, yes, also, thank you very much for the tip, Brian. And yeah, boner spear, boner spear, banner spear, bone shaper is like definitely the best combo. Um, or spear, eh, you say? Yes. Uh, I forget this one, so I'm I'm going to be honest. Pretending to be guards does sound neat. <laughs> I'll vote against it. Oh, also, also, um, Cliff, it's not names. It's outpost phases. So luckily, uh, you if, if if the name Satha comes up every outpost phase, you still get credit. Hey, but, it says event or section. Yes. So. Yeah, 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 yeah. I yeah. read it in a section. And I read Satha in a section, and I read Captain What's-His-Face in an event. So yes, but two. it's eight different outpost phases. Oh, different. Yeah. Boo! It's, so you're looking, you're looking for eight phases. All right, we're going to do option, option B. So, we are, so we're falling in line? Yes. That, that is the consensus. All right. Yeah. We don't have, we don't have no uh, events. All right, to, so that's option B, yes? Yes, the bottom one. Right. Captain Captain Olmstead balls his fists and bites his bites his tongue. Yes, these are guards. He stares daggers at you in training. The emissary marks a few makes a few marks on his pad of paper. Well, it's still shameful to see them so underdressed. See to it they get the supplies they need. I expect them armored within the hour. Captain Olmstead smiles through gritted teeth. Of course, sir. I'll see to it personally. The captain leads you to the armory a little more forcefully than necessary. All characters without armored, which is a thing, gain one armor item, or ch chest body chest item, crafted from one or two material resources. I think I have armored, unfortunately. I do, so I don't what get anything. Armored? Um, what is it's a it's a trait on the thing, uh, in your uh, uh, chest. That's resourceful, strong. Yes, yeah, so you can go through the craftable thing. Fucking a. Uh, I think there's a cloak that. I think that the death. So where do we like determine this. armored? It's oh, uh, do you see below uh, your um? Is it on your character sheet? Yeah, it's on your character sheet. Do you see well, right here? I'm looking at mine. Yeah. Yeah. I was just thinking it would be based on the items you have, but no, nope. it's based on what character you are. Yeah. Okay, so uh, okay, now we so can give... I, I don't think that's going to be better, but can it sell it for gold? If that's the yep. case, you can sell the other one for two, four gold. 
Yeah. I guess so, crude hide armor for me. Cool. What is this negative one thing? That means you're going to put a negative one in your deck if you equip it. However, some people have a perk that allows you to ignore it. For example, uh -huh. this thing right here. If you get to that perk, you can ignore the negative item effects on it. You Ooh. can also hold on to it and then not use it. Um, I don't know. Cliff, I do if, like the crude helmet. Cliff, if you want to, you can just, whatever you get, you can just sell for four gold. The That's resources. what I'm going to do. Cool, go I'm ahead. Four gold. Yep. And then... And P Peter, think. Peter wants gold anyway, so. Oops, man, I'm bad at this. Yeah. What do you guys think? Um. So you don't already have a body one? Nope. Nope. Um, I'd say I'd say use the armor. Oh, it has to be body. Never mind. Yeah, 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 it. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, especially so, with you being up front, I think that's worth it, even with the the a single minus the minus one. ones. Yeah, if, if and, you and take even them. And, and even if you get one more check mark, you can use this. Yeah, it's the first two attacks against you have disadvantage. So I have to throw this into my card, right? Into and, my shuffle. Into what? I take this and throw it into one of these. Uh yes, into your draw pile. Yeah, into your draw pile. Flip it over though. <laughs> okay, um, but yeah, so uh, we can now craft items too. Uh, this goes to the inactive stack. And that's, All right. that's well, an outpost event. Let's, so let's think about what we've got for next time. We've got Algox Scouting or Algox Offensive. We also have the Offensive Marcel scenario. We have, the, we have the Marcel it scenario. Seems, it seems a bit early for the Marcel Stop. scenario. It's, it's, hold on. It's timed. So the earlier no. you do it, but the earlier you do it, quote the better. But it'll only delay retirement by one week if we um, go do another thing. So we can totally do another thing. It only affects that. Um, no, I, I really feel like finishing some Algox business. Would I be... am perfectly fine with that as well. That's 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 all right. Fine. So so we got offensive, which is uh, the attackers that left here went back to their cave. And then the scouting, which is a smaller band, went around to the eastern face. Yes. So do we want to investigate the smaller band on the eastern face, or do we want to go into the cave where the um, guys retreated from from this attack? Well, uh, wh what do you think, Clyde? Kill. Well, um, I think it's killing regardless. I don't think there's. Yeah, okay. but uh, but the big group went back to the the base of the mountain. So. Hmm. Do we want to go to the base of the mountain and kill? Try to attack the big group. I think. Um, I must think about this. Read them again, because the scouting actually like. All right, so we I, got. Better, but let me let me. Yeah, so we there. got. Uh, the, the Valrath Scout tracked the attackers to the foothill of the Coverdeck Mountains, where they entered a cave at the base of the Snowscorn Mountain, which is the offensive. Or, interestingly, a smaller band split from the main group before they reached the cave and hiked around to the mountain's deadly eastern face. And that's Algox Scouting. Hmm. The scout didn't see where the smaller group went, but he yeah. suspects a secret entrance to the Algox yeah, stronghold. They, they they split off for a reason. Yeah, I want to know that reason. Yep, I agree. So okay. scenario two next. All right, we'll go do we'll do Algox scouting next week. I'll set up an event for it. I I'm assuming all the other like goofiness of learning how this all works will like we'll have less problems next time. So, but I think ultimately once we like caught the momentum of how all this like. I think it went pretty well. Yeah. Oh, I, I agree. I think it went well, but I think there's just a couple uh, rando hiccups of just like. Oh well, yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, the, the mod let, not letting anybody but you click anywhere. Exactly. But I like, mean, stuff. That's so just our. That's just our over eagerness to want to get started early. Yeah. So this all went fantastically. Yeah. Certainly, so not least of which is the excellent graffiti that has, has oh, yes. adorned the board. <laughs> the, the, the We've graffiti. got a, a hyper realistic giant. 
face up there. I mean, that's just graffiti in its per like it's graffiti of graffiti in digital form. That's just absolutely perfect. and also and also highly relevant to our WWF nerd. Exactly. Out. Yes. Yes. That's what, that's uh, what I came to mind. Thank you so much for doing that. Okay, so, but I, I do think I well, I, like I said, we'll just leave it on and then we'll, we'll, we'll leave it on. We'll leave it on for next week. I'll I'll and, get the mod just, moved. Oh, oh, construction. And then, and then oh, we got to build over, stuff. Like, yes, that's like the real, final part uh, of the thing. All right, but is everyone done crafting, buying, or anything? Uh, I, yep. I'm, I'm holding on to my stuff. Okay, construction. So, by the way, we have some uh, buildings we can upgrade. So, first off, we can upgrade the craftsman to level two. The craftsman adds more. Do you know how, how we have the list of items that we can craft? Uh -huh. We can expand it by upgrading the craftsman. We can upgrade the al alchemist to level two. We don't know what it does. I do, but I. I just all I'm going to say is I think that's lower priority. Workshop allows us to boat sled or climbing gear. We are aware that eventually there are scenarios oh. that are going to tell us, stop, you don't continue further, you need one of these. The, they happen somewhat soon, but not immediately, so I wouldn't worry about it. We can't upgrade the barracks. But one of these, can... one of these right, transports but do we even, is still... Do we even have the stuff to be able yes, to upgrade Yes, yes, we them? absolutely have the stuff. Okay. We, can, we can combine it as a group. And last but not least, we have foundations. Ah. We can upgrade. We can build the first wall. We have uh, a, a whole season until winter, so the wall won't often come into play. And then we also have three different foundations to rebuild. That is the mining camp, the hunting lodge, and the logging camp. And I imagine those are just going to give us resources over time. Yes, and I personally, those if if we were to allow to insight knowledge, I think these are the best things. Because they're good to have them early. Because the earlier you build yeah, them, yeah. Because as soon as we get them, we're going to get more stuff. Yes. Yeah. I. 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 Hmm, I but I'll, I'll allow you to pick. Which, I mean, I'd yeah. say probably mining camp. Mining was what I was leaving. Mining camp. All right. Do we have four lumber between all of us? Uh, I, I have think. two lumber. Um. Oh no. I, uh. Between us. No. Uh. The Death Walker and I, we can burn two lumber each. So let's mm -hmm. just stick to the mining camp. All right. Yeah, I think it's good. Uh, first, there, first, there's four gold or four lumber. What would logging camp take out of curiosity? Um, logging camp. I think that's an even split of like two, three, two. All oh, right. I see. It. Do we have two metal left over? I've got some metal. Um, I have no metal. I have no metal. How much metal do you have? I have one metal. Okay. Well, we're gonna steal one of uh, Vince's as well. And last, we need a single hide. I got that. All right, can we drop that? And now that, that. we need to split 10 gold between us. Uh, uh, I think Vince needs it for retirement, so I think he shouldn't. I have. Yeah, I've got, I've got four that I can drop. Okay, I've you've got, got four. I, I, how about this? I'll drop six gold. And okay. Cool. So I keep my gold then? I'll, I just yep. need two gold. Okay, and then Cl uh, Cliff drops four. Guess what? As a yep. result, we now admit everything. And then what happens is we click this, and we now have a mining camp. Also, I love the fact that the stickers... By the way, the more you do the campaign, this starts to fill in. And I love this like thing. But also, we get the card uh, mining camp level one, which is perfectly on top. What's the number on it? Five? Yep. One, two, oh, three. it's already there. Oh, did it actually move it? Wow, it literally put the card out. At the all right, so this is this the sun thing means every time you know I said the alchemist phase is in five phases. During the third third phase, we can turn two gold into one metal every phase. Which Oh nice. Yeah. Uh, it can only happen once per phase, but this allows us every outpost phase, we we're basically gonna, gonna get a metal from now on. So, um, that's that's it for construction. Also, uh, at the bottom right uh, we see this also has this exclamation point, plus one prosperity. Almost every building has a prosperity bump. So that's the main way of improving prosperity of this. So, uh, yeah, I, I think that was a pretty fun session overall. Yay! Uh, I, I thoroughly enjoyed it myself. I hope other people did. Yep, that was great. Hopefully it was, hopefully it'll play well in the, uh, people watch it that's okay watch i'm sure I'm, I'm sh the the other the other streams don't like they don't traditionally go amazingly but there there's enough of a following that people watch it and we had a few people that said that they enjoyed it so yeah um um there's one more question here i missed this 
um, about the RPG book. Well, that includes story for the... It will not have the Frosthaven characters. It just has the Gloomhaven characters. Sorry. But yeah. Any f- any last words? Praise Zorn. Praise Zorn? Praise, yeah, praise <laughs> Zorn, I guess. Praise Zorn. Uh, we're, still, we're still doing that. 